It is time for us to continue on. All right, so in our last session, we uh, were able to get the moon seal and and the uh, word of power and the next moon seal and the next word of power, and we we're able to finish up exploring the uh, entirety of the abbey grounds and all that, and we got all the various collectibles that are there to be found in the Abbey, all the documents and 
paintings and whatnot. So now we can focus on uh, the gameplay. So I don't know. I think uh, we didn't go to sleep. I think we uh, we just uh, went to the room. Yeah, we just went to the room. We're gonna go to bed now. Yep, dream time. And we got a different perspective on mother here. So let's see what uh Dear child, we do not have much time. Let's... We shall be reunited soon. I cannot help but feel excitement. We are standing in front of each other right now. Not here, but in the physical realm. You don't need to be coy. I know you are coming. To where exactly? The Sanctum Santorum. The prophecy advances. As much as it will please me to see you, I beg you not to stand in my way. I cannot guarantee your safety this time. Mm. The Sanctum is more than just a stronghold. It is Strange's home. He will never let it go. I once thought that about the Abbey, so many centuries ago. I have said all I can. It is out of my hands now. Actually, it seems to be all in your hands. I wish that were so. But you know the truth. He is closer than ever before. Who is? I would not dare say his name in this place. Still... He will bring us together after so long. Is it selfish of me to say that it's our reunion that matters most? So, on one hand, kind of starting to feel a little, just a teeny, weeny bit sorry for her. She basically, why is my door shut? Oh, because I get to see her. see each other soon, mother. Um... She became the way she did, basically to save him from uh, dying as a baby, apparently. Something. Agatha. It's all right, child. You have been through so much. Your mother is calling you back to her. Trying to break anything that stands between you. Consider this barrier to be as unbreakable as my resolve to not follow in her footsteps. Yes, I believe that. Your ancestral powers are awakening and taking root. They would be pleased you are choosing the angels of your better nature. But the real question is, are you pleased? Is this the path you want to continue to walk? Um... No, I mean, yes and no. I'm going to say yes. Yes, Agatha. This path pleases me. I am confident that the only thing that can defeat darkness is the blinding brilliance of light. Then shine it. Drown out your mother's shadow. I intend to. Just remember... Whoever you choose to be, I accept you. Because uh, I'm at the point now where we're at 105 light, trying to move all the way to the dark side. Yeah, no. I mean, all you all you really get is an outfit and some special uh, what you call it. Feeling good today, girl. Collar things. I'm trying to go, trying to go from this much in the light to that much in the dark, eh, just to get some more collar things. It's eh, a little. Uh, what's what's what I'm looking for? Um. Uh, what's what I'm looking for? Uh, I don't know what the word is I'm looking for. Fine, speak. Hey, Magic. Hey, yeah. Uh, doing some yoga today? Doing a workout? That's your, that's your workout clothes. Um. You feeling all right? 
That's, I can't think of, I can't think of the word I'm looking for. Um, not unreliable. Um, not un. Yeah, I can't think of this word I'm looking for. Um. Oh, yeah, for whatever reason, I cannot think of the uh, word I'm looking for. There are some more wards I could place on it if I can just get time. All right, uh, let's continue our essence checking. We'll talk to Steve to finish up our friendship. Wait, is that why we need to talk to Steve? Um, I don't remember hitting a friendship level with him. The Abbey exudes a comforting aura. Yeah, we gotta make sure, we gotta send, uh, Carol to the, uh, the healing spa today. Um, hold on. Oh yeah, I guess we did hit a friendship level with him. I didn't realize that. Okay, movie narrator man. Lovecraft, Crowley, Transcendental Magic, Conquest Through Technology and Mysticism by Victor Von Doom. <laughs> Guessing this library doesn't carry the Hardy Boys. I am unfamiliar with their work. I brought you here, Hunter, so we might reconnect with your roots. To remind you of who you are, where you came from, and where you can go. And, more importantly, who I believe you can become. If the answers to my destiny were in these pages, I am sure we would have found them by now. You are the author of your destiny, Hunter. Great. Now I'm starting to sound like Nick Fury's autobiography. Keep striving to be the best version of the hunter you can be. If you keep doing the work, nothing will be out of your reach. Except for that row of encyclopedias at the top of that bookshelf. I'm pretty sure you're gonna need a ladder for that. <laughs> okay. Um, does anyone else want to chat? No, all right. <clears throat> Did we send anyone on a mission? To see you. No, we didn't. Thanks, Hunter. All right, let's go ahead and send. Uh, she needs to go on this. Oh, I guess not. Doctor Strange knows Merlin. I'm still waiting huh. for someone to take this sword. I could have sworn Carol was hurt. What's up, Tony? Can I ask a favor? Purchase and equip a new hunter head prop. Sure. Um, I'll do that, and then I'm going to undo that. Um, Uh, let's see. Oh, no. let's see. Um, we got the demon things. Wait, is it the same? Here, go ahead and buy some shades, I guess. There. I wonder if he'll change those daily as well. Right this way, Hunter. We've got the latest in symbiote fight. Awesome. Thanks, Hunter. Yeah, no problem, buddy. All right. <clears throat> Hunter, what you've got there is the latest in custom alloy, handcrafted, magically protected personal protective gear. Yes, thanks to the symbiote sample young Mr. Parker recovered, we were able to isolate the alien energy signature that appeared to be causing you so much trouble. 
With this armor, you should now be able to get close enough to Venom to take him down. This time without, you know, exploding. It feels good. Now, just give me back to New York and I will handle the rest. I All right. Predicted this outcome, but it is intriguing. So, let's see here. When uh, you play a card, 10% chance to generate a symbiote bind. All right. And go ahead and do this, and we still need to do three more missions on that, but go ahead and do this one here. Please tell me it's not another animal. No, 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 this is legendary, so who knows what it could be. It's a legendary ball. winning this war after all. Let's see, anything good from this one? This is some of my best work. No. Select an ally, taunt all enemies, targeting them, gain block. That's kind of cool. Uh, another one of those things. Uh, well, this is definitely a keeper. Um. Big Tony's Forge of Mystery. We never close. Um. <clears throat> I wish I knew well, what we had here for a quick jab. Um, go ahead and grab that. Go ahead and grab the. Go ahead and grab that. Day, Hunter. Um, <clears throat> it is acquired. The uh, shell passive along with the new suit. Pass abilities can be swapped at any time, regardless of which suit he's wearing. Why do I look like Spider-Man? So, this is the passive? No, that's different. When did I get that? Um, when a light card is played, 10% chance to generate Simian Bind. I presume that means I can bind somebody. Um, so we can change the color of it too. I unlocked the Salem outfit. Um, oh, Faithbreaker, or, yeah, no, I can't, although maybe it looked like I could change the color of it. Um, human child, um, gain one resist each turn. You and Doggo attacks have greatly increased chances to be critical and drawn. Huh, interesting. Alright, take those shades off. I'm sorry. Although, you may automatically put those shades back on. Oh, hello, guys. What's up? Looking good, Hunter. The new outfit looks spectacular. Just really badass. Oh. Thank you. It's amazing what a little teamwork can produce. Teamwork? Oh, you mean Stark and Strange. They finally got along enough to make this. I just hope it's enough to stop Venom. Faith. I do not know if it will be enough. I'd rather do Stark and Strange. The armor may be Faithbreaker, but I have faith it will work. Oh, a little wordplay. You should use that line on Tony. It would probably bring a tear to his eye. I could discuss this armor all day, but... Oh, I know. You've got a date with a symbiote. Don't let me stand in the way. Good luck out there. What the new armor suits you. It looks pretty spectacular. 
Jealous? Incredibly. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I'll, I'll do what, Nidio? If you like it, I can see about having Strange and Stark make one for you as well. Those two? <laughs> they barely kept it together long enough to make this for you. I'm not gonna push my luck. Besides, I got my own style. Okay, apparently everyone wants to talk to me today. Uh, not, not Deadpool. Okay, who else wants to talk? Just out of curiosity, just you guys. Where's uh, where's Nico at? Is Nico over here? Hold on, we're missing some. Oh, there's. What's wrong, Nico? I saw the new armor hunter. One word, slick. Thank you. Uh, any compliments I can throw out? How many compliments do I have, real quick? Um, I got eight compliments. All right. Who could use a uh, a compliments? Well, you're already at the next level, so no one, no to you. Uh, you're already next level. Um. Doctor's getting close. Um. Well, hold on, hold off on the compliments. Okay, say what you gotta say, guys. Rest easy, Spider-Man. I have dealt with the unknowable before. Yes, but have you ever worn clothes with their own appetite? I know symbiotic alien goop can seem like a cool idea, but take it from me, not worth it one bit. The symbiote gets in your brain and makes you do things you'd never ordinarily do. I admit this sounds uncomfortable, but we both know that a hero's journey rarely leads to a fluffy bed and a good night's rest. The Sanctum Sanctorum falling to Hydra would harm innocence and is therefore worth the risk. Look, I didn't think I could talk you out of it. But if you feel the urge to eat people, it means take the suit off immediately. Do not worry, Peter. If I feel cannibalistic, I will strip down to my undergarments. When that happened to me, I had to wear a paper bag for a mask. Every time I tell that story, people always wisecrack that a paper bag is an improvement over my usual costume. <laughs> no comment. At two, Hunter? At two? I guess there's no other way, huh? Only this suit can penetrate the symbiote barrier around the sanctum. Yeah, I hear that too. What sits worse with me? The sanctum sanctorum is wearing a symbiote. Alien possessed architecture gives me the extra creeps. To stand against the forces seeking to fulfill the prophecy, we must conquer what terrors hold us from our duty. Fear holds us back. Fear makes us small. Eh, you can't fault a scientist for voicing an abundance of caution. I cannot. And your warning is heard, Spider-Man. I shall be alert and ready should the suit try and tempt me. Hey, that's all I needed to hear. <laughs> Hunter, I hate to say something as cliche as, you got this. So I'll say something cheesier. I believe in you. Just be careful wearing that extraterrestrial tracksuit, Hunter. Last thing we want is for you to turn against us. Thank you for your concern, Spider-Man. Thanks for hearing me out, Hunter. All right, what you got, caretaker? Perhaps, Aunt, the Spider-Man is correct. This is not the first time we've used the weapons of the enemy to fight our enemy. And it will not be the last. But it is your decision, Hunter. You are the one wearing it. I have endured corrupting forces in the past. Whatever this symbiote's nature truly is, I shall not let its thoughts become mine. I expect nothing less from you, Hunter. I suppose I do have a single misgiving, Hunter. 
If the symbiote has any unusual reactions to your collar, well, keep an eye on it and be sure to let me know as soon as possible. Is my collar going to be a problem? If it is, perhaps there are wards we could apply. Or just make me another one. Neither of those options would do you any good. I don't foresee any unintended consequences of mixing the arcane with the alien, but we cannot be certain. Hunter, you must take extreme caution in all actions. The threads binding our reality together are inextricably bound in surprising ways. Sometimes they are stitches, other times knots or tangles. Reckless action and needless risk are the threats we must be most aware of. Now, put on your alien suit and go free the Sanctum Sanctorum of Lilith's corruption. I don't know okay, I'm cute. To be founded, but oh, hold on. Is certain. <clears throat> if he is oh. Right, I fully expect Spider-Man to be annoying about it. So don't let that happen. Remember, if your collar reacts oddly to the symbiote, alert me immediately. All right, well, we're going to push this forward because obviously we have to. Um, oh, we're taking five people. Why? Well, I guess, well, that explains why Carol doesn't need um, any healing. All right, so. Go see. Uh, Someone's going to die. Uh, I'm hoping that's a compliment from you and not a threat. All right, so who are we gonna spar with? Um, what's this? Okay, hold on. Yeah, I'm super short term memory on that. <clears throat> Was Blade on there? No, hold on. Um, it was Blade. Okay, the doctor. We'll spar with the doctor. As these three were at, um, what do we call it? With, um, we're already at friendship levels with them, so we'll go spar with the doctor. Doctor Strange seems excited to return to the same. Now, the question is, is what's going to happen to us? <clears throat> At, at the sanctum. Even a sorcerer supreme can't rest on his laurel. All right, let's go do this. I mean, there's no one else to talk to, right? Uh, doesn't look like it. All right, let's go ahead and save. We continue to save. Alright. Never had a mission with five people before. It kind of sucks up the card rotation though. Because in a normal ro uh, normal mission, three heroes, eight cards each, that's 24 cards. So, and I think it always redraws to have at least five cards in, in the hand. So, that leaves 19 cards out. So there's a 1 in 19 chance of drawing a card you need. You know, or that you quote unquote want. You got 5 people. <clears throat> that's 40 cards in the mix. So I'm kind of curious how this is going to play out. Still no sign of Venom. The Parker boy really came through. Even with his disappearance, his pet symbiote has unfortunately not given up its taste for my sanctum. Neither has Hydra. They've upped the guard again, which I didn't even think was possible. This symbiote creature has had a stranglehold on us long enough. It is time to strike. Are you sure that thing is safe? Well, we didn't exactly have a manual, but the science and spooky bits are sound. You should be well protected. It's a big risk. So is leaving Lilith in command of the Sanctum. You're both right. But I bet you have another option. 
Sorry, didn't mean to spoil your moment. A frontal assault has too many variables, but there's always the hole. The back door, of course. I know the risks, but at some point we have to start believing in each other. In ourselves. Your design will hold. We would never let you step into battle unprepared. Besides, what was the first rule of demon hunting you taught me? If at first you don't succeed, stab, stab, stab again. again. Aw, you think Reed and Sue have such heartwarming moments with Johnny and Ben? <laughs> Okay, so it looks like I'm initially going into battle with these two. <clears throat> and I'm guessing we're going to another point and we swap over, huh? Squad two. I mean, it's not like I can change the squads. I guess I could change that if I wanted to. All right. <clears throat> We're gonna get the Sanctum back for Strange. I like your optimism. Thanks. I have a good feeling about this. I have a good feeling about you. What was that? Uh, nothing. Boo Hydra. <laughs> Nicely done, Blade. Nicely done. Hey, the whole crew's here! Why do I get a... Any, any last words? Yes. You? You? Alright, let's do this. <clears throat> I mean, it's not like this is the last mission. At least. We need to strike now while we still have the chance. I agree. Now is the time to strike. And don't worry about the suit, Hunter. We've got your back. <laughs> All right. Let's see how this is. So are they gonna like take me prisoner after the end of this mission? I almost think that may happen. Consumes everything, even itself. Ready for round two. Always. Oh, well, that was easy. Objective, purchase symbiont, defeat enemies to acquire that card. Uh, that will immediately summon additional reinforcements to the fight. Oh, to their side. Purge the uh, symbiont from all three pillars. I'm guessing you can only purge one at a time. So just like on... Uh, well, so basically purge one. Oh yeah, yeah, thanks. What was that? I don't know. Just... Alright, anyhow, uh, we got 
two, three, four, five, six, three on Hunter, two on Blade, one on Carol, uh, two babies, and two heavies, two mediums. All right, got our Blade Storm, okay. Um, that'll do a total of uh, three, yeah, ninety three, ninety three damage. Not quite enough to do that. We could use you on a baby to get a counter. Uh, forceful, quick. Uh, so we can use you and the other baby. All right, so one baby there. That's not a quick though, but we hit a baby with that, get the counter. Um, can almost use that. Actually, that there will kill the sniper. <clears throat> All right, let's do that. So you kill one baby, kill the baby attacking you. Okay. Quick jab. Um, so do we want? You no, know, let's go for the quick. We don't need knockback. Kill that baby. Uh, what was that? I didn't feel a thing thing. Um, 20% chance to gain counter on knockout. Okay. Um. Oh, no. And that counter lasts for the rest of the turn. So you're going to counter this dude here. Um. So you could actually do this on him. And well, it would knock him out, but anyhow, uh, we're gonna use this on him. Well, do we use it on you or do we use it on you? Because you you gotta take two actions to to even get up to speed. Whereas this guy could potentially make us vulnerable or weak or whatnot. But let's attack you while you're visible. All right, um, we got a forceful knockback. Um, taunt. Um, Um, go and do that. Your time has come. Not bad. This is a serious predicament for you. Um, so we can either get block for fifty six. Um, she has no block right now, or we can do this. She'll get a counter. Which will stack her in, into next round. Because this will kill her, th that one. Um, actually, let's do this. Um, blade, do a. Let me just check something, okay. Blade, do a move hit on him into him. Okay. Alright, now. Not worried about that right now. Um. We 
we already have a counter with her. So go ahead and do this taunt. Because this taunt will give her a counter. Sorry, not counter, but give her block. I mean, he's got four resists. Um, go ahead and do this. Desertion rate is for hydro lackeys. All right, let's see what happens here. Hail Hydra. Follow my lead. I get to hit you back. Yeah. Get me out of here. Avoid <clears throat> Okay, these reinforcements are all babies. So, this chain will take care of the babies. Not really worried about Supernova. I mean, it does kind of suck that she got weak on that. Um, I'm not going to pop that just yet. <clears throat> Let's take out the three babies. If I can get the damn camera to work with me here. Well, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is there, that cosmic ray can take out a baby. Take him out twice. Ah, oh, screw it. Go ahead and chain, triple chain him. How much is he at? Okay, so he's at... Okay. So... Eh, what sucks is... I This is the only one of his I got. And... I kind of want to think about saving that for... Second round. Uh, we need to take this dude out here. Go ahead and chain him. Triple chain him. You kiss the mother with that mouth. Well, good news is, is this is not ex an exhaust. Uh, we can kill those three since they are babies. So go ahead and. Good pop two to do that. This has you. All right, uh, have her go binary. Um, because he's going to go after him. <clears throat> Do that. And that's a weak hit, too. And then, uh, let's have somebody who's not weak, like Blade, come and do a move hit on you to kill you. Or Hunter. That works, too. All right, so we'll do this next round. Because it's, it's only him. All right, so... I almost want to do that at the beginning of the round. Um, oops. Looks like they want to try a few more. All right, go ahead and do this right now. Stark and the doctor aren't here to see their little project in action. The Faithbreaker will finally purge Venom's foul corruption from the Sanctum and the city. The end of the day is 
still come down to me punching some. Some things never get old, kiddo. Be the specialist to yep. All right. Um, which one are we attacking? You, huh? All right. Well, we have Blade Storm here. Forceful knockback, which is going to cause a lot of havoc here. Try to see what different things we have here to do as much damage as we can to folks. But those are babies. Um, what's over here? Oh, that's a drop. Um, we do it that way, like so. That'll work. All right, now, <clears throat> um, we don't know who you're going after. Uh, you're down to 213. Um, I don't know, what are the, uh, what's the, the what's the knockover percentage? 25% with you, what about with, um, what about with her? Just out of curiosity. Same percentage, okay. Well, you're going after Blade. Actually, all three of you are going after Blade. Um. You know what? Go ahead and do this. Okay, we got a hero combo we can use, a bleeder we can use. Um, okay, let's see what happens. I think Blade will be okay. Oh, you know, I forgot to do my, I could have done a move. My bad, I forgot to do that. Frenzy, okay. It's too bad those gloves won't work for anyone else. We'd love All to right. see Carol, but Captain Marvel knocked those tendrils of some car. Aw, oh, Blade. Such a sweet talker. Indeed. For now, leave the faith breaker to me. Alright, we're gonna do this on you. You into him. Leave some for the rest of us. And we're not interrogating uh, right now. Um, we may do that. We may not. Um. You're how much? 93. 93. That there. I hate to actually waste the, the bleed on, on that one. Um, that's going to flat out kill him. I hate to waste that large one also. Um, how about a move? Uh, 
Nah, just shy of uh, knocking him off. I don't know. That that won't that'll do damage to you, but okay. Um, screw it. Go ahead and kill Mr. Uh, Mr. Frenzy. All right, so Let's see here you've got five resists You've got no resists, but a lot of block um Do we do this now or do we wait for next round? Let's go ahead. We'll wait for next round. Um, we do have our move, but I can't. Actually, Carol can move, knock one of these guys into that. That'll be an easy kill. You should have known better. We we'll go ahead and pop this. All right, go ahead and take us to the next uh, next turn. He's like, uh, do I want to do this? He wasn't sure there for a second. Okay, these are all babies. Uh, let's go ahead and pop this now. Okay, what do we got here? Um, who's got it? This guy here's got it, okay. Um, we got one, two. You know what I'm thinking about doing? <clears throat> Bleeding these guys. Who's going after who here? We got two on Carol, four on Hunter, one on Blade. Well, Hunter's fine. He's got five resists. Um, I don't know why he's got five resists or how he's got five resists, but he's got five resists. Um, we can do this on the three non babies. Um, the bleed that's applied, I think, is going to be in the 80s. So. Or. We hit the babies for this. So the draw is a card for each KO. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's get the let's get the guarantees out of the way. Well, three of them at least. Ignore him. Um, go ahead and hit him. So we'll draw three cards on this. <clears throat> You for that in New York blade. All right, that's good. We got a quick good knockback. Uh, forced knockback. All right. Well, 
We can obviously knock him back, but can we do a quick knock back on you? That would kill you. Go do that. All right, uh, I don't have any other quicks. <clears throat> so we're gonna use the hero on him. Which will actually kill him, I just now noticed. Or 78. Oh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, I didn't realize his shield was down that low. Okay, that one actually works. I didn't realize that. Good KO. Then, yeah, she still gets hit by a damn shock shield. Bullshit. Alright, so then we got a baby and a uh, not so baby. He's gonna take 89 on his <clears throat> bleed. Um, knock him into the wall, so he'll bleed to death. All right, and go ahead and turn. And next round, we purge the last pillar. Oh, I missed the fact that there were two babies over there. Crossbones will just keep throwing hydro bodies in there until you're exhausted. Now, as long as he his ass doesn't show up. Bitch, who's to say he won't show up? We've only encountered him that one time, though. He hasn't been like. Wanda or Venom that has appeared uh, randomly. We've broken through. Gonna sound like one of Blade's action movies right now, but go! Get to the sanctum! Okay. So what are we now doing? Changing to the second? Mother, you kept me waiting, child. I am here now. Yes, alone, always so alone. Did I miss the party? You are just in time. I told you the door works now. Sorry! First apocalypse excitement, I guess. The little sorcerer returns home. Can't say I like what you've done with the place, demon mother, or my friend. No matter. Already, the power of the sanctum returns to me. Your days of plundering its secrets end today! But that was never the plan. Now. Yes, mother. Using it as a gateway? Seek, Seek what? Attack, defending enemies to break protection on the mystics. Damaging mystics will disrupt the connection to the summoning ritual. Summoning portal will collapse when all mystics have been interrupted. How hard could that be? We serve until the end. We stand with the mother. I only see two shieldmen. At least I think I only see two shieldmen.
Spidey, this would be a great time for opportunity. This infernal device has torn through the wards themselves. <clears throat> okay, so chance of stopping Lilith, we must interrupt her mystics ritual and seal that breach. So remember, first it's free with Spider-Man. Um uh, chain one, two, three. There are four babies. Uh, any quicks? No quicks. All right, well, go ahead and chain the babies. All right. I would say that qualifies as amazing. Uh, we got a quick there. Um, but we're not gonna be able to do that to anyone. Uh, we can take. No, we can't take him out. Um, can hit him with that because he does. Spider-Man, wait. <clears throat> Why is that? Hold on. Um. Wait, what happened to his first one's free? Um, yeah, I'm confused now. Okay, so you can't be... It says, um, immune to taunts. So how does this work on you? There's 25% chance of us knocking her into the, the whatchamacallit. I don't know if I like the odds of 20, uh, of that. Um... We could go with this. We don't know who he's attacking. We don't know who he's attacking either. We want to hit. <clears throat> we want to interrupt. Uh, we need to interrupt her uh, while still trying to hurt these guys here. So I'm thinking if we do a. You're immune to knockback. You're not immune to the damage, just the knockback. Um, that does a 115 slide. Yeah, you know what? Do this. Uh. Yeah, go ahead and hit that person into the, the thing. Well for you. Even the mother of demons is forced to rely upon hired hands occasionally. They deserve no mercy. And then... You know what? Go ahead and do this. Actually, yeah, do that. Your face is sealed. That technically will disrupt it. Weak, even for Hydra. Their mystics fall before us. Uh, I don't think I can. Technically, I can't do that. All right, let's see what happens here. Well, we still have a move. Um, hey, Spidey. Uh, 
Oh, so I don't have to worry about killing you. I don't think. I think I just have to stop all three of you. So, are you going to go back to summoning? Hellhounds. Ooh, double protection. Uh, who are you protecting? Shut down the uh, fighters pack. Every one of them is targeting the same hero. If you taunt, shut down, taunt them on. Okay. Let's begin. You're protected, but you're not doing anything. Um, they're babies. Um. It's just where's Hunter at? Hunter's over there. Um uh, Damn it. This might work. Yeah, I have an idea. Forceful knockback, okay, so we do this. Uh, fortunately, we don't have anything to hit you in. But this gets me repositioned. Don't know if this will work or not. All right, so now we do this on you. Towards her. Like it's up to me. That interrupted the thing, so the whole should collapse, right? Alright, now we just have to kill people. In uh in uh, 220 block and one counter taunt all enemies. Well, Forceful knockback. Okay, so the two hounds are going after Spidey. Um, you're going after the doctor. I have no idea who the shields are going after. Uh, or no idea who the damn these guys are going after. Um, you do that to break... Actually, no, if you're going to do it, ah, son of a bitch, <clears throat> I'd actually rather hold off, get that up to six, um, because then we can do that and then do that. Um, you know what? You've got a shit ton of resist. How many bad guys are on here? One, two, three. Right, one, two, three. Ah, oh, man, I'm losing track here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, we let Hunter do this. He's gonna counter everyone. We get extra block. Plus he's resistant. Screw it, do it. All right, but just to see if we can help him out just a wee bit. Um, doctor, if you wouldn't mind, could you please knock this dog into knock him into Spider-Man. It's remarkable how well Hydra manages to attract new recruits despite decades. All right. 
Let's see, uh, let's see what happens here. For the mother. Suffer. Damn. The curse is upon you. And enjoy it. Um, are you planning on countering at all? Or do you only counter melee attacks? Um... What the hell is Cursed? When he plays a card, discard a random card, move after a card is played around a turn. I will be he didn't. I mean, he didn't take any damage, so that's a good thing. He didn't counter a single time, not that I see. All right, so we got a free card there, but it requires heroism. So now, now you give me this thing here. All right. So we're gonna do this. Just to get our. Uh, not to brag, but. Good just to get out uh, what you would call it up um now we're gonna do this on who let's do this on the shield dudes get their shields down so do it on do this one on him or hold on because this is gonna do 394 all right go ahead and do this one on him Come on, game. Do this one on him. Break his shield. By Lilith, and it may very well cost you your life. Um, we could do that, but no, oh, but if we do that, then we lose this. So go ahead and do this. with a sorcerer supreme all right now spider-man <clears throat> we also can do this uh who would we want to bind um yeah one two on the doctor one on hunter you want to bind him He's weak for two rounds, so I'm actually not worried about him. Um, find her. Because we can't quite get a kill on her. Um, we have three actions we can do. Um... I think a move hit on you to kill the dog will be one. We'll throw this at somebody. That'll be two. Actually, do it on Spider-Man because these things do more damage. Um, so that'll be 158. Um... We have a vault for 215 we can do. Now, just because they knocked us out of the arena, as it were, doesn't necessarily mean they're, it was really damaging. All right, uh, so let's do this. Uh, one, bump into him, get rid of this dog. Or better yet, who? So kill the dog. Or do extra damage. You know, do this. It's All right. For the rest of us. So go ahead and take this. Hit this lady with it. Take that. All right. So then we can move. 
Um, does it, can't hit you with, actually, you could be hit with that. All right, so come over here. We'll vault. Let's do the vault because it's gonna um it costs more. So go ahead and vault here. Because I'm not worried about Hunter. Hunter's got a lot of sh uh, shielding. Here we go. Uh. No, I, I mean it's, it's not killing this guy, so it's not really a ma uh, factor. But still, if it was bleeding, it'd be better. And then we'll spend the points to hit this lady here. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> um. Let's see what happens. Hail Hydra! Your end is near. Okay, that hurt a wee bit. Okay, so now he's cursed. The hell are you doing? Um, what's with the Damn this interference? Not getting through. The mystical barrier that separates the realms is collapsing. Some technical difficulties are to be expected. Um, you can still hear me, Sarah. But if something should happen, please tell Tony not to touch my stuff. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. We hit this. Kill one of you. Apply weak to the other two. Go ahead and do that. Now that was something. Uh, let's see. Um, quick knockback on you. Into your own hole. How about that? Good one. Ah, oh, bullshit. The endless search for wealth and power with just <laughs> that was fashion. bullshit. Will never change. <clears throat> All right, uh, he's going after Spidey. You're going after what's his name? I'm not worried about interrogating. Hey, Spidey, you want to give this a shot? Actually, we have two. Oh, the, the table's broken. Never mind. Um, actually, yeah, Spidey, do this. Damn, won't quite kill him, but. Um, can't actually, you know what? Use it. Actually, uh, let Hunter do that one. No, not going to trigger you, but I'm worried about. 
No, I shouldn't have to worry because angle wise, if he's restricted to the same angles I'm restricted to, neither one of them can. Well, let's see what happens here. Hail Are more dogs going to pop out of that, that thing? We'll... You know what? Better stuns and knock on the hole. Is that dog dead? I think that dog may be dead. Yeah, that dog's dead. If he, okay. Yeah, we'll get him on this round here. your temper, Doctor. This would be it. We got him on this one here. Um, that's a baby, so we can just run him into the wall or something like that. Um, into the stairs. Uh, we don't need the hero combo. Uh, hero combo actually probably wouldn't be bad. Um, so if we do this, that'll bump up the damage of this and this. Spider-Man's out for a minute, so go ahead and do this. Let's this lady here. Um but the question is, is there any place to uh, knock you into? Yeah, we can knock your ass all the way over there. In fact, that'll kill you. For the servants of Lilith. Nicely done. Okay, we do a quick. Come on, turn. We do a quick on this bitch. You were too weak for this fight. And now let's finish up with the dog. I suppose we could interrogate one person. Well, hold on. Can we hit this dog into anything? Yeah. So let's go ahead and interrogate somebody. Uh, shield guard, mystic. Yeah, go ahead and uh, interrogate one of the mystics. Cause I've never interrogated a mystic before. I don't know if we get anything else. Who knows what we get out of it. Did I get anything out of it? I didn't. Is that loot obtained? What loot? I don't know. I don't think there was that any loot to begin with. <clears throat> All right. Well done, my friends. They yeah, may need to call our. Uh, decorator to have this place refix, uh, fixed up. Or you can just do some magic and... Wait, I'm confused. Okay. All that work just for it to get blown up? I'm confused. Really? Only a one star? Up yours! Well, maybe it's got the whole 11 turns, but still. I mean, we stopped the summoning. Shouldn't that have prevented this? Oh. <laughs> 
Although I will say I was expecting something else to take place at the Sanctum. <clears throat> the way that we had that dream about Mother and she's like, yeah, you'll come to me, blah, blah, this, blah, blah, that, and... Okay, I'm just gonna say it. That really, really sucked. Try adding a few dozen more reallys. I'm in shock. I... I didn't expect to lose the Sanctum. Oh, you didn't expect to lose the Sanctum? That was my whole life. Ripped open and decimated before my eyes. We need to have a serious conversation about Lilith. She's much stronger than we anticipated. We did everything we could, and it still wasn't enough. Uh, Lilith is a pain, for sure. But right now, she's hiding behind our boy Bruce. And if he's giving her IT advice, then that's a problem I can do something about. I failed. How else can I describe it? I failed not just my teammates, but the world. That's right. You did fail. All of you. Oh, hey, don't sugarcoat it or anything. But that doesn't mean you lost. And that is an important distinction. This war is far from over. And tomorrow we will rise again. And fight again. I'm too tired for a hoorah. But the sentiment is there. I appreciate the inspirational words. We all need it. I'm sure. Now rest, get some sleep. All of you, the battle will wait until morning. What's off to the left? At the sun? Why are we, uh... What are we looking at there? Obviously, uh, it's one of the... Rings planets. All right. Book club meeting. All right. Yep, let's have our book club tonight. All right. What else is on the super duper link? Uh, just in. All right, anyhow. Uh, any chatters today? Now, we might be able to continue on his story and her story and... Because uh, we haven't picked up Wolverine yet. Everyone's hanging around the table. <clears throat> Except for... Doctor and Sarah, they're over here, oddly enough, as opposed to over here. Um, how's our... Okay, so... Today is, uh... Today is Punk Rock Day, apparently, for our fight. Punk Rock Day for you, too? Nope. Alright, but before we go on, I'm gonna grab me a drink real quick, and... We'll continue on in just a moment, so be right back.
All righty. See what we got here. Just looking at some. Um, let's see, we don't give him a compliment. Push him to four. Um, everyone else who went on a mission with us is already in prestige. So. All righty. I know this is difficult for you, Stephen, but the sanctum is gone, and we need to plan for what comes next. What's next? Armageddon has already happened. What's next is hell on Earth. The barrier has been breached. Expect the world to fall city by city, nation by nation. I'm not ready to give up, and neither should you. It's not just losing the sanctum that hurts us. It's also Banner. We will handle him, as long as he doesn't become the Hulk. It's his mind that I'm most worried about. That rift charge is just the start of the awful things he could conceive of. He is Lilith's most powerful weapon now. Then you know what we need to fight back with, right? We tried. Blaze is being impossible unless he gives us the parchment. Shh. Voices carry. Let Blaze. Us Johnny Blaze. Where are you? Have you heard everything that's happening? Well, obviously I can't talk. I can't give him a compliment right now. What's up, pup? Hello, my sweet girl. Well, Doctor Strange is fascinating. His magic is incredibly powerful. The stock. I can't imagine how Doctor Strange feels right now. I would like to offer my sympathies, but you do not wish to disturb him. I'm sure he'd like to be with his own thoughts. Um. I think Doctor Strange would appreciate the support right now, even if it is just kind words. Thank you for your insight, Hunter. Everyone is different when it comes to grieving. The Sanctum was his home, but he has a place here in the Abbey. I hope that sentiment comforts him. Either way, I recognize how important it is to have a safe haven to return to. Did the X-Men have a similar home? We do. We've had several close calls, but there's still a place for us to return to. I don't want Steven to think I'm pitying him. Doctor Strange will not assume you are offering him pity. He will know you are being genuine. I worry. I suppose it just depends on how I word it. Coming from someone who is still learning their social cues, that is very true. <laughs> Maybe we can workshop something together. I appreciate your help, Hunter. Sure, my pleasure. Oh, uh, what's going to come from the words of Deadpool? This should be entertaining. Don't hey, what's up, Unicorn? I'll blind you. With I heard Strange's spooky funhouse went poof. But look on the bright side. Things can't get any worse. I am a little surprised by your optimism. Why? Half the weirdos here have survived more than one apocalypse. A house going bye-bye isn't too bad. You have a point, but Strange just lost his home. This was another major loss. Yeah, sorry, pal, but I find it hard to cry over a bunch of wood and nails. Unless I'm crashing through a building. Yeesh. You have never had a home? Nope. Not unless you count the abandoned subway system. She may have smelled like garbage. But <clears throat> it is my garbage. The Abbey's the only home you ever had, right? Correct. I spent my entire life here. And what came after? So you'd be like Dr. Magic Man if this place went down in flames. Uh, it's hard to say. I cannot say. It is hard to imagine myself without the Abbey. Kinda like how it's hard to imagine me without Hydra Bob. I get it. Home can sometimes be a person. You read that off a doormat? <laughs> I won't say a peep to Doctor Strange about his house. Don't worry. 
I don't know if... Hey, pup. Did I just see you a minute ago? Are you following me? What you doing, Charlie? Lilith and her minions did a number on New York. Ah, who cares? And New York is just a taste of what is to come if we do not stop her. I haven't seen the city in such a state since Blade and I tore through Times Square. That was even worse. Mm. What happened between you and Blade? Do you want the long version or the short version? I'll say. We got time. I want details. It was our first encounter. Blade wondered if I was an alien, because I was unlike any other vampire he'd fought. You are unlike any other vampire. Hmm, true. Anyway, he tried to stab me with a wooden stake. I threw him off the roof of a building. The battle only ended after I drained him of a few pints of blood. Wait, you mean you bit Blade? Oh yes. In fact, I believe my bite granted Blade his vampiric strength. Blade says he was born a Dampir. Well, that's his side of the story. But I know the man I once fought only grew stronger after that encounter. I am unsure who to believe. I may ask Blade about this. No need. I just told you everything you need to know. He's a bit sensitive about the topic. <laughs> hey, and there's talk. Wait. <clears throat> I'm confused. Dog was right here, and then he ran back in here. Nothing new there. But hey, at least the dog still has his flying cape. This is not going the way I wanted it to. The sanctum's gone. Hell has literally come to Earth. Good on, Nico. Another superhero landmark is destroyed. What a disaster. That yeah, could be worse, right? Experience. Things always get bleak before they get better. Things don't get more bleak than this. Sure they can. You know, Agatha, isn't it about time you show yourself to Sarah yet? You know, we're almost at the end of day's time here. All right. What do we see here? So, zombies? More vampires in Manhattan. The green sky is growing. All right. Let's not give in to rumors. Sorry, Cap. I don't think these are just rumors. The old Spidey sense has been on double red alert since... We lost the Sanctum? Perhaps now you understand why I was so adamant we save it. Think of the Sanctum as our world's supernatural ozone layer. When it breaks down or explodes... Holes open up. Only in this case, instead of a nasty sunburn, you get demons. Lots of demons. And his children basked in his light as the temple of the false gods fell. Oh, what album is that from? The prophecy. The dark god Cthon readies his return. Well, does the dark god Cthon own a dude ranch in the southwest? Because there's a whole lot of something going on out there. Should, uh, probably tell them. About? The carnival. Johnny Blaze and the Quentin Carnival. No way. Who exactly is Johnny Blaze? Guy's sort of a, a jerk. Legend. Famous stunt rider, fellow spirit of vengeance, and keeper of the parchment of power. The final page of the Darkhold. The missing piece my mother needs to complete the prophecy and free Cthon. When were you gonna tell the rest of us this? Welcome to our world. The entire point of a secret guardian is to remain secret. Yeah. From the look of things, I'd say your little secret is out. With the barrier gone, our enemies must have been able to detect the page's foul presence. Lord knows what wretched evil Lilith sent to retrieve it. 
Oh. New region available. Missions can appear in any region that's been unlocked. Oh. So I can go to the southwest. Oh, and there's uh, Wolverine again. Uh, can we do Venom's mission yet? Damn it. All right. Time to go get Venom. The Spidey. All right, well, the Southwest can wait. It ain't going anywhere. Spidey, suit up. We're about to go on a mission. Okay, so that's... All right, so this here, uh, first mission car recovered. Oh, that! I like that, then. All right, uh, I think we'll take Captain America with us. Welcome to Tony's Scary Demon Cave. I'm Tony, and how may I assist you today? I don't think there's any cards here that I want. What can I say except you're welcome? Um, I already got Inspire. This modded version actually gives you a plus there. And, and uh, what's the uh, upgrade of this again? Free, yeah. Actually, that one could potentially be good <clears throat> to take with us. You know, may, or take, uh, to swap into. Um, we already got two sets of opportunists that are modded, so don't need that. Um, I mean, we'll uh, do I take this because we can break it down in uh, what should we call it? But that inspire, I think we may just take and upgrade that. Sometimes I even impress myself. Mind bender. Um, go ahead and grab these two. Just because they're modded, I think that I think that one card was modded for Inspire, was it not? Um, yeah, it's modded, All right? Um, so question is, is we get rid of heal, remove heal for that or not? Because. I don't want to get rid of these. Um, I could get rid of Holy Flame. Yeah, you know what? Get rid of Holy Flame. For now. I'd rather have the quick uh, knockback and these forceful knockbacks. Even though Holy Flame does damage, I still want to keep my heal. So just for now, we'll get rid of that. Put it in Spire. We'll upgrade that so it becomes free. Um, no one else had anything that's worth, um, upgrading. Somebody else wants to talk. Uh, we'll track them down here in a minute. So, that was weird. Um, buyer gifts. <clears throat> if we can, we want to see Doctor Strange. Uh, he should be out of, uh... He should be out of the watch we caught right now. Time to take it to the next level. Because if anything, it's a free card that'll give us one heroic. Uh, increase level to 20. Yeah, I didn't think I was going to be able to train with Spidey. Um... All right, between, okay, I need to see here. Peace. Who's, you are, you're almost 19. Um, so we, we can bump someone up to 20. I'd prefer to bump up one of the lowers. Um, what level is Nico? I never, is she 21? No, she's at 20. Um, do we have anyone at 21? No. <clears throat> um. Yeah, 
Who do I want to bump up to 20? My lucky day, huh? Let's do it. Eh, I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, go ahead with Carol. I wasn't holding back, I see. Alright, um who else wants to talk now? I don't see uh Oh, the doctor. Oh, that's actually good. I wanted to talk to the doctor also. I gotta, uh, gotta make sure I install that uh, that upgrade too. Hey, doctor. Here, let me compliment you first. I do not think there is a single spell you are unfamiliar with. Thanks. I do enjoy flattery. Okay, so that will bump him up to the next friendship level. Doctor. If you come to cheer me up, don't waste your time. There is nothing you can do or say that could possibly lift my spirits. I do not believe someone as strong as you would break so easily. Easily? The sanctum has exploded. My home gone and the war against your mother nearly lost. No. You saw that all that dark energy burst from my building, electrifying the New York skyline with a supernatural storm. Those were Lilith's forces erupting into this world. Now they are free to scour every corner of this earth for the parchment. You should have let me go down with the Sanctum. Maybe I could have reactivated some ward of protection that would have prevented all her Lilin from escaping into the wild. Um... Have you considered this was destined to happen? All part of the divine plan that will eventually give us the upper hand? If that's true, this is the most hellish path I've ever marched towards victory on. We must accept this loss and gather our resolve. Exactly. Like it or not, the reality is that Lilith is one step closer from completing the Darkhold and summoning... Cthon. We cannot let that happen. Good talk. All right, so tomorrow, um, he'll get his next level up. Anyone else? Anyone who's not prestige close? So no. What is you, what is your special? You're in combat with 43 block. Oh, okay, cool. Um, you're 10 away. Uh, your prestige. Um, you're 10 away. Yeah, I'm gonna give Deadpool and the Doctor a compliment also, I think. I've got <clears throat> eight compliments available, so let me go ahead and uh give them a compliment real quick. But yeah, I'm gonna do this upgrade also. Terrible for our chances against your mother. Things are looking up around here. Okay. Bye. Bye. All right. Um, doctor, where are you at? Cause you're always in here reading. Things always look a little brighter. You tear through enemies like you tear through medical journals. Hey, Nico. I would take you on this, but I gotta take Captain America on this mission, unfortunately. Um. Anyone seen there's... Charlie? I need some Hellhound cuddles. Charlie? Is one Charlie coming up? You, you ask for him, I will track his ass down for you. Or her ass. Charlie. Hey, Charlie. Follow me, Charlie. Come along, Charlie. Magic went to your cuddles. 
Does your mother have a thing for deserts and healing crystals? There. Wait there. Wait here, girl. There you go, magic, just for you. Charlie's here for you. Uh oh, Deadpool, that's who we're going for. Damn. What are we gonna do without the sanctum? We will make it through. Don't you worry. Alright. Let's go recruit Venom. I mean, I plan on taking Captain America on this if we can. I don't know if we can or not. Talk of a slime monster lurking beneath Manhattan does not mean. Oh, it does. Look, I know Eddie and Venom. They're not what you'd call unsore losers. And we did, you know, kind of bury them under an old bell tower. Has anyone seen the creature since? Long gone by the time Shield showed up. They go to ground when you wound their pride. In this case, underground. Venom on the loose, licking his wounds. Now that's a friendly neighborhood problem. So, how about we go solve it? Do you have a question? <laughs> you gotta work on your social cues. Well, really, it's just the two of us. Okay. Kind of feel, you know, like I should get in the other outfit, but who we'll goes punk rock hunter? Are you worried that Venom will hold a grudge? I wouldn't say worried. I've come to expect it. And you still think this is a good idea? Yeah. He tries to be a savior, but sometimes he needs to be saved from himself. Besides, what's the worst that could happen? He could eat one of us. See? Could be worse. Yeah. Yes, stay on the path. Yes. No, no, nothing. I mean, should I be wear should I have worn the special venom outfit? I don't know. Slime monster. Vampire. Ah, uh, vampires. Maybe it's the Downtown Express? Sounds like a lair. Oh, great. Sounds like. Slime monster. Time for seconds. Breakfast for dinner, I guess. With a side of vamp over easy. Not so easy for the vamp. Oh, gross, Eddie. It's hard to know who to root for in these parasite versus parasite situations. Parasite. A demonically possessed symbiote with a vampire's bloodlust. Not good. Come on, Eddie, don't do this. They are definitely doing this. All right, defeat blood venom. Uh, venom's consumption of vampires will put him into a permanent frenzy. <clears throat> blood venom symbiote bind can be broken by attacking them, okay? Blood venom won't wait until the end of an enemy turn launch attack. Move quickly. Crawl back to the sewers. Once Lilith had no use for it. Yes. We have no use for Lilith. We don't need her. Tell your okay. whatever you have to. Uh, not to interrupt, but have you really been eating those vampires, Eddie? The rarest meat of all. So if all right. you are what you eat, what does that make you? 
All right, so this has got we want to pop that we got three uh, I think it's three cards for that That's two cards <clears throat> um, Chain strike won't do shit for us However, this one here will at least get us a card. Um, I kind of want to pop this. So it's just us versus him. So. And does he have the standard symbiote? Yep, okay. So let's try this. Actually. Wait, I thought no, I guess I oh no that wait no that's a knockback, that's a forceful. Alright, let's go can I hit you into that? Nah, uh, it's just it's off. But we can stun him. Ooh, I like it. That's only gonna last for one card play. No, but it says by the sun only restrained for one action. Um, all right, well, we're gonna do this. Ooh, but see, that's I'd almost rather hit you with that, namely because it's gonna apply weak on you. Yeah, go ahead. your strength worry about that well we got to do this to free him or Well, then again, we don't know. He may go after these vampires. But then again, if he goes after those vampires, that may heal him. Um, actually, this will work, because that's considered a knockout. Uh, I don't care about the knock back. But that is a knockout. Too weak for this fight. Or... Was it? Yeah, it was. Um. Yeah, we're gonna kill the babies with this. Namely, do that. Do that. Uh, do we want to hit you? Or do we want to damage this? We'll go with the damage on this. This one's for you. Maybe I don't know. You should have asked. Lily before that. Wait, how did it pop already? How the hell did it pop already? Uh, never mind. Don't have to worry about that shit anymore. Well, that's kind of fucked up, isn't it? I only got one move. <clears throat> no, we have. No, um, shit. The only way I can get another move is if I do a discard. Well. Thing is though, his action will take place after two card draws. So, let's do this. Uh, 
Uh, I don't know if I can do this or not. Did I do that? Ooh, that really <clears throat> get hurt. Well, let's see what happens here. Because he doesn't take his normal action until the end of... Um... More of them are joining the fight. That's good. That's fine. Let him run into that. All we have to do is. This is low even for you, Eddie. Moping in the uh, This kind of sucks. You're better than this. <clears throat> we are better. Better than Lilith. Better than you. Yeah, I meant more on a personal or even spiritual level, you know? We know your blood. Will make us stronger than she ever told. He has not lost his way with words. So he's gonna pop in two card plays. Um Yeah, let me see. If I do this, I'm just looking to see if it's going to show me a, a good landing spot. If I chain the babies. I don't see uh, I don't see a landing spot anywhere. Um... I could do a knockback any direction. Knock him this way. If I knock him into the wall there. Go ahead and do that. Okay, so he's going to take care of those two. Um, fortunately, <clears throat> Spidey's in a bad spot here, and he can't do a knockback. Uh, this one here is a bleed. Uh, so technically, we want to redraw that. Um, we got to redraw it. Uh, actually, this is free. Which will make this playable right now. But it's a free card to play, so go ahead and do that. Let him pop. We're safe. You gonna move somewhere else? All right, so. Oh no, it's a random one. <clears throat> um, that's right. I was thinking of something else. All right, so this one here. Unfortunately, if we do this, I mean, that'll take you out of phase one. Two got the two babies there to deal with. But actually, Hunter can take care of them. He's got the angle to do a f uh, move hit on them. Um, all right, so go ahead and do this. Well, there goes that one vaulting thing. Leave some for the right. rest of us. Now he's actually downed until the end of the turn. Uh, interestingly enough, is that card? I didn't realize that card was a uh, uh, what should we call it? A uh,
No, 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 not wrong person, wrong person. Stop. I didn't realize that card was a uh, refund on KO. All right, so just uh, go ahead and cycle to the next turn. What is? What do you got on you? Oh, he's got one more environmental attack for free. Actually, no, he hasn't. No, he hasn't used his free environmental yet. being chased across the city but this is really getting gross it's all right so worse down here he's not eating roses <laughs> but chain the babies then obviously finish on him looks like it's up to me Got him marked. Not like that matters. All the time for like decades. Okay, he's gonna go after I play this card, which may screw shit up. So I'm gonna do this, um, so I can get one of these. He's got plenty of blocks, so I'm not worried about. Um, not worried about Hunter per se. We're gonna go ahead and overheal Spidey. That's also gonna give me two cards. The light is on our side. Okay, now Venom's gonna go. You gonna bind me or just punch me? You gonna bind me? Which kind of sucks because. But that rock there looks close enough. All right, we're going to use ah, uh, damn it. Actually, I hate to do that. That sucks. I'd hate to waste this on him. And I can't use the rock. I don't think I can hit him with the rock. No, it's just out of room, out of range. So, if I do this, well, then this will take place next hand. Um, This is not the bleed one, so go ahead and do it. Actually, if I knock you into him... Then I can use this on you. Yeah, that's an idea. So I got uh, three moves. So this is not a move. I got, uh, let me just double check. I've got a total of three heroes and things. The next two deal extra damage. All right, so do this for one. Try this on for size. Okay, then we're going to move here. We're going to then move shove you into him. Which will break the bind. Okay. Then I'm gonna move over here. Do this on you. 
Okay. Um. Next, this is a free one, so I might as well play it. He's gonna frenzy. The power of the light. Okay. Okay, now let's go ahead and in the turn. <clears throat> You'll be fine with your bleed. More hydra coming in quick. Those aren't Hydra. Those are vampires. Alright, so Remember now we combo we you. We had our differences, but were they really as bad as this? Good or bad. We have had enough of all of you! I'm really getting through to him today. But I'm trying to understand how he's going to be a, an ally at the Abbey. Okay, he's down. You're as good as everybody says. Do we have to finish up the bad babies? do love a moral dilemma the umami of an otherwise flavorless existence Mephisto Gesundheit uh, nice mullet go to hell there's nowhere I would rather be but I've come on business so let's make a deal is this one of those fiddle at the crossroads scenarios or no deal my terms are as follows I spare venom I cure the symbiote of Lilith's demonic touch. I end the blood fever he's given himself, gorging on curdled vampire bile. I wretch a little thinking of it. I said, no deal. All this, and I ask but one inconsequential thing in return. Stop the vampire uprising. The undead are bad for business. That actually sounds like a good deal. And we keep doing what we've been doing? Yes. Wipe them out. Remove every trace of their foul scourge from the earth. Then I will cure this pathetic creature forever. For the last time, no. Hold up. Give me the fine print. Nothing much. The usual. If you should fail, you'll discover something far more threatening than the undead, namely yours truly, etc., etc., immortal soul, yada, yada. This is a bad idea. This is where he dies? We don't have much of a choice. I'm in. Good. Just sign there and there. You may feel a little steep. We should follow. You do have a vampire war to wage. Oh, and Peter, I'll see you around. How did he know my... Huh. <laughs> Defeat all enemies, okay? Surprises we've had so far, <clears throat> that was one of the weirdest. Venom's offense is increased for each point of ravenous, and he starts every encounter with the next amount of ravenous. But ourselves, we will spare you 
for now. Hey, that's progress. He didn't threaten to eat you. That is progress. All right, so his offensive increase for each point of revenue, and he starts every encounter with the max amount. One ravenous is consumed whenever he uses an attack or heroic, but one ravenous will also be regenerated at the start of return. Plan the use of his abilities carefully to maximize damage from ravenous. How many ravenous do you have? Three. So each attack you do. So I said each attack in heroic costs one. I guess you're capped at three. Okay. So we got uh, two sacks. Let's see. Um, tendril did two. Uh, draw one of his attack or hero cards. And the next one will not consume a ravenous. Okay. <clears throat> Forceful knockback. Um, that fire is actually good. Uh, we don't need a forceful for that. Um, a normal, do we have a normal knockback? No. A uh, move knockback should take care of that. Which will kill him, obviously. Kill that baby. Hurt that baby, partially hurt that. Uh, this is a vault. No, that's a slide, excuse me. Uh, slide for that. Um, actually, we could do a forceful knockback perhaps on you if we got the angle right. Um, where's Spidey at? Spidey's there. You, uh, oh, that's towards him. So we don't we don't do towards you can you do a forceful uh just off damn it oh we can still do that because that will maybe blow him up i don't know so go ahead and have him here right there you have earned this awesome all right i don't think i can do a, a, a actually no that'll work all right so that, that one works so far so uh so good uh we can do a forceful on well we could bring you into that Or, if we bring you in the Venom, yeah, let's do it that way. Alright. I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. I like how they both spin the face the next target. Um... It's a 144. Let's go ahead and take out this sack here. Uh, one less sack to worry about. I know we lose the regenerate or the the constant block build up, but all right. Let's see what happens here. Because <clears throat> I already used my move shove. Um, the only thing I could do is with Spidey. Uh, I could do this with Spidey. Although I'd rather... Uh, I don't, ooh. That's tempting, actually. Actually, because Spidey doesn't have a free one. Um, so let's do it. No, no, he does have his free. Oh yeah, go ahead, do Spidey. Go ahead and drop it on that. I'm going for it. All 
And then with that being the case, Venom can do a slide. Actually, wait. You have another one still available? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, Spidey, if you would, if you'd be so kind, move right here. Knock this out. Oh, this should be. Okay, so all the baby um, sacks are gone. All right, so now we just got one baby there and one basic baby there, essentially. See what happens here. Um, this is the worst headache any ever had. We need a nap. Almost forgot what you were like before Lilith got in your head. Yeah, let's go ahead and let him uh, have some fun. It is your fault Lilith got in our head to begin with. Is that really what you think? I have to keep you from eating my neighbors. Always following us, stopping us. Leaving us hungry! Well, that is kind of my job. Ha! Huh. I think that's the last of them. And not a moment too soon. So are you gonna, like, I don't know, transform... ...when we, uh, take you back to the Abbey? Well, obviously you're not going to the Abbey with us just yet. Or maybe you will, I don't know. I think he just transformed. Is that... Eddie? Well, this is awkward. You... Are the man in the monster? Something like that. So, you okay, Eddie? Blood! <laughs> it's getting a little joke. Uh, I, I come in peace. For once. Really? New kids gotta get in on this, too? Hey, by the way, you're killing it out there. Respect. Uh, thank <laughs> you. Not my first vampire war. Eddie, are you yourself again? Well, you mean, are we ourselves yeah Lilith uh, she made us a monster we did awful things you know that's not who we are right of course so I'm sitting here well in there and thinking <clears throat> I saw what you did for me so how about we put aside all our uh, you know personal stuff okay no not forever just just until this whole messed up vampire situation is figured out. Till all the innocent people are safe. I mean, that would make sense, wouldn't it? Yeah. I don't know. Works for me. Shake on it. Oh. Huh. Wait a sec. Put her there, partner. I'm there, partner. Welcome to the Midnight Suns. Okay. Venom is back. All right, so let's see what stuff he's got in his uh, deck. Oh, emo kid meeting. I thought today was a book club meeting. I swear to God, well, no, I said yeah, I'm ready next time they're available. 
All right, let's go do an emo kid meeting. Oh, so don't get mad, but caretaker wants to run emo kids tonight. No, oh, no. I do not like it, but I can live with it. That's where I'm at, as long as it's just a night. All right, let's do this. All right, let's do it. Lead the way. <clears throat> Anything more for you? No. Magic? Hey, at least you wore the t-shirt. Actually, two of you wore the t-shirt. Gotta feel out of place now. Should we get Sarah a t-shirt? Tonight's ritual will prove to be an absolute treat. Why am I just now finding out that Emo Kids serves dessert? Did you bring it out after I leave? No, we don't... No. I mean, caretaker's mastery of... Uh, I thought I was going to get something out of that haunting, haunting but oh well. Of the world old. I confess my ignorance as to her methods is quite thrilling. A rarity for any Sorcerer Supreme. <laughs> Alright. Let's, uh, let's deal on today's thing. How much did Nico tell you about tonight's meeting? Very little. She said you are leading it. I suspect you have an opinion on the matter. Say what you must. Um. I am ready. That's all? Yes. When do we start? As soon as you want. Tonight I will cocoon your conscious mind from your past self. When you are ready, we can safely observe the events of your death. How does this work? Is this some kind of hypnosis? No, it's old magic. Once used to heal tormented minds, it allows one to observe and process past events that may be painful to consider. Why didn't you think of this sooner? You've been gone so long. Until the last meeting, it didn't occur to me that the events of your death are, to you, quite recent. Now then, shall we proceed? Sure, why not? We can begin. What is the last memory on the night of your death? Uh, Asking me to join her. Yeah, that's right. Keep it close. That's where you'll begin. Been so long since we had an email meeting, I forgot. Right. What do you see? Lilith and I face each other in the circle. Join you? Why would I ever do that? Since my transformation, I have made so many children, yet all pale beside my greatest creation. My true child, perfect, conceived in my very image. I am nothing like you. Not yet, but you will be. When I remove the shackles that bind no. you. I will never stand by your side. Foolish child. You have no choice in the... But we can no longer afford such lies. I cannot move. The Darkhold. She has the Darkhold. You cling to the delusions of your captors. Embrace your true self trapped within. She lifts the dark hole high. She. <clears throat> and. That's it? That's how the hunter died? There's nothing more. So the hunter died because of a book? Miss Rasputin, the dark hole is hardly a book. So Lilith read the hunter to death. I guess she channeled her demon powers through the dark hole. Ugh. Still a boring way to die. But still, how did Lilith die then? Did, did, did I kill her too? Also, there's one little graphics glitch in that. We are looking at the past, but yet when you saw the collar around his neck in the uh, image, uh, it also had the crack. What did you think, Nico? 
What did Lilith mean about your true self? Hmm. We are finding more questions than answers. True, but we have someone here who can help decipher them. Sarah knows her sister better than anyone alive. Perhaps she has insight on what Lilith meant. Oh, yeah. I will talk to Sarah. Sounds good. What about you? Observing your own death can lead to sleepless nights, I know from personal experience. If you have trouble sleeping, I can write you a prescription. Really? A joke, of course. I'm not licensed in this state. Nothing for you? What do you got? You died predictably. You <laughs> sound disappointed. Death for the hunter should not be so banal. Next time, add some spice. <laughs> You're okay. stuck in a combine harvester. Have a sack of starving weasels tied around your face. Anything but demon powers. Wow. Okay. I'm disappointed. I thought there'd be more to it. Same here. I always thought her attack on the Abbey was to recover the Darkhold, but it appears it was a means to an end. Yeah, so what about the true self? What she said about me, my true self, can you explain that? No, it's nonsense, but she clearly believed what she said. Perhaps we can use this against her. How? When we're ready to face her, you may be able to divert her attention. You want to use me as bait? Well, if you're offering. Why is using me as bait always your plan? <laughs> because it works. Okay. After I died, was that how you found me? Yes. You and Lilith. With a dark hold between you. If she used it to kill me, how did she die? Exactly. The Dark Hold is a dangerous book. Maybe the power was too much for her to control. I know where my body ended up. What of Lilith? The Knights of Wondergore took Lilith's body. I didn't ask where, and didn't want to know. And the Dark Hold? Also provided to the Knights, in pieces for them to scatter throughout the world. It worked for centuries, until Hydra tracked them down. That is all I wanted to ask. Are you all right? This can't have been easy to relive. Uh, don't know what to think yet. <clears throat> it is better than not knowing, but I am still figuring out how to feel about it. That's normal. Take your time. There's no need to rush. I won't keep you. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you. Um... Anyone else got anything to say? Just Nico? I think that's it. You leaving? Yeah, might as well. That is it for me. Sounds good. See you next meeting. <laughs> We got another Morningstar card. Although I still don't understand the purpose of it. Well, I mean, I do, but I don't. And a Holy Burst. And another Mindbreaker. Um, I don't know if I... I know I got one of these. I just don't know if it's the upgraded variation. Oops. Yeah, go ahead and take that one. All right, and now Eddie. Okay, let's have a little... We'll chat here with Eddie in a few minutes. Let me go do our evening essence checks. Oh great, another mouth to feed. Do you think I'm made of money? Well, you're right. Sometimes Eddie's emotions get the better. I'm actually surprised how calmly everyone is taking to Eddie being here. 
I mean, he's gonna be an interesting one to understand to use. So now I gotta take him and Captain America on some missions, because I'm sure Eddie's got some research projects um, that are associated with him. Yeah. More pallets. Uh, any golds open? Uh, got that gold there. Um, we got a gold up. Wait, there's this another gold up there. I don't remember there being two golds up there. Okay, you got my interest. There's a second gold one up here? I knew about that one. Is this what you're considering gold? No. Oh, that's in the cave. That's in the, um... That's in the, yeah, I just, I just think about that. That's, uh, that's in the, the trial cave. Um. Although it's probably not going to give me much. I actually, I actually opened up one of these and it didn't give me anything, which was actually weird. Not even any money or gloss or anything. And it gives me a whole bunch of these combat items, which sadly I have never used. No, I think I used one. Um, all right, I'll go here. <clears throat> I'm running the wrong way. That's over here. Back here, if I remember. Yep, there it is. I mean, there can't be that many. Uh, Fleet Foot is good, I guess. Can't be that many more cosmetic uh, color palettes that we can collect. I mean, surely we're going to run out of that soon. All right, um, let's see. Uh, I already went up there, went in there, went down there. Um, any over here? Hold on, I'm missing something. Let's be, he's either outside, or excuse me, she's either outside or she's in our room. There she is. I go pet the puppy. Okay. There we go. I will see if I can find you a treat later. All right, let's go talk to this Venom dude. See what he's got to say. Another day. And you guys really put the home in home base. This is an impressive setup. I hope the accommodations are better than what my mother provided. Uh, your mother gave me a lot of stuff, but most of it was grief. Uh, thanks again for what you did for me. As if my past wasn't complicated enough, your mother added a fresh pile of regrets. Um, Peter. Eddie, you are here because a mutual friend believes in you. Uh, you mean he believes I'm trouble. And he's not entirely wrong. I do not want you at each other's throats. Look, Parker and I have a complicated history, but it's water under the bridge. Oh, well, I guess we're still building that bridge. But we have bigger fish to fry from the uh, bridge. <laughs> but enough about us. Can you trust me after everything that happened? I mean, I kept trying to eat you. Um...
Let's go with this. Um, you were a different person. I cannot blame you for my mother's control. Oh, that's a relief. I was actually expecting him to say something like that. Wanna hug it out? Sorry, nah, I just made it awkward, didn't I? No more than Peter Parker does. So, now that we've cleared the air, I'm a little worried about the deal we made with the devil. That's the first time I've meant it literally. Um... It's his choice. I agree with you, but Peter made his decision. Our plan was to stop the new breed vampires. Now we can do so with your help. Maybe. I can't shake the feeling that he traded the devil we know for the devil we... Well, for another devil we know. Why are there so many devils? If the world ends, we shall never know. I'm glad you sound confident. The symbiote and I are on the fence. No offense, but I hear there's a gym here, and I'm itching to check it out. I'm gonna do that, unless you need something else. Hmm, let me go to our normal get-to-know-you-better get spiel. Um... I would like to know more about you. Really? Like what? What was your life like before you became Venom? I was a reporter, and I was pretty good at it. Well, I was okay. Somewhere between okay and pretty good. Had a few wins. Then one major gaffe blew up my whole career. What happened? <laughs> uh, it's a long story. And not my favorite one to tell. Maybe I'll share the details someday. All you need to know is that it nearly ended my career. I still find the occasional reporting gig, but... Well, let's just say it's for news sites with stories about how the government buries alien bodies in the desert. Do they? Oh, yeah. Just not the kind of aliens these sites talk about. <laughs> what drives you to fight for justice? Plenty of people will tell you I'm no hero. Some of them might be living in the Abbey. But I really do care about doing what's right. I guess you could say I had a tough childhood. Always wished I'd had a strong friend who could save me from the monsters in my life. So I became a monster. To save those too small to fight for themselves. Now they might be afraid of me, but... I'll keep them safe. You seem ruthless for a hero. Is that a question? Half the Midnight Suns believe the greater good can sometimes outweigh a single life, but none of them, well, eat their enemies. <laughs> you could put it that way. Eh, my brand of justice is an acquired taste. I would like to know more about your symbiote. Naturally, go for it. How did you and the symbiote connect with one another? I got bitten by a radioactive pool of motor oil. What? <laughs> uh, nah, that would have been less traumatic. Truth is, Spider-Man brought the symbiote back from space. Space? <laughs> Be surprised what that kid gets up to. Anyway, Parker found the suit ill-fitting. His loss was my gain. Maybe I'll tell you the story someday. What are your capabilities on the battlefield? But without your mom's demonic protein powder, we can still bench press a bus if we need to. We also have limited shape-shifting abilities. Our tendrils are handy when we need to grab something or web someone to a wall. Uh, oh, and we can also camouflage ourselves if needed. Don't tell Parker, but he traded down when he went back to those red and blue pajamas. <laughs> I noticed that you sometimes refer to yourself as we. Why is that? Because I'm a king in black. What does that mean? It doesn't matter. Truth is, Venom isn't a singular personality. It's a combination of myself and the symbiote. That's why we say we. It must be strange to have a conversation with the voice inside your head. Yeah, well, if you thought it was hard fighting vampires, try doing it when your costume is yelling in your ear. Eddie? Can I talk to Venom now? Uh, that's not how it works. 
I'm not deranged. I just share a body with an alien symbiote. And okay, yeah, that does sound deranged. <laughs> it also happens to be true. You want to talk to Venom? You always are, Hunter. Okay. Actually, I have to. <clears throat> I'm around if you need me. Alright, let's take a look here at uh, Venom. <clears throat> so, we've got Tendril Strikes, which uh, upgraded will be quick. We've got the Web Toss, uh, Knockback in the Direction, usable on grounded targets. Immune to knockback and force. Oh, so we can use this on shield dudes. No, no, I'm sorry. Unusable. Oh, sorry, unusable. My bad. Uh, okay, so basically, you can't use that on a shield dude who's protecting someone or other quote unquote grounded folks. Um, upgrading becomes forceful, so that's good. I like forceful. Uh, the Simeon Sense upgraded. That's the next two cards, not use Ravenous. All right, and then your Heroic, which we didn't actually see in that fight. Lifesteal, and then if you KO, the next card doesn't use Ravenous. Okay. <clears throat> so it's kind of curious, you know, to actually see how your uh, Ravenous stuff works out. All right, so go ahead and put that on daily change because we have you do that. And anti venom, nice. Fallen venom. Oh, so you can go back to that outfit, huh? All right, well, anyhow, you're gonna change your outfit daily. Okay, just because. I think my suit is romantically attracted to your new outfit. That's funny. Nah, I'm kidding. All right. <laughs> Anyhow, um, so oh, more people to talk to. Wash the taste of stale blood out of my mouth. All right, what you think, Carol? Anything else on your mind? But you're the one who wanted to talk. No. Oh. What does Shield know about Mephisto? What does an international espionage agency know about the actual devil? Yes. Not very much. That is alarming. Look, if Satan had a nuke, I could hand you a dossier thicker than your head. But he doesn't, so... Frankly, I should be asking you. What can you tell me about Mephisto? Well, he is the actual devil. Which is more than what S.H.I.E.L.D. will ever admit to knowing about Mephisto. <laughs> well, that was... enlightening. Mephisto detests new breed vampires. Do we know why? I have no good answer for that. Nothing based on facts. My gut tells me new breed vampires keep him from getting something he wants. As for what that is... You'll have to ask the devil. Okay. Thanks, Carol. Well, I know... Hunter didn't sign the contract, not that I saw. Peter signed it. <clears throat> Peter, are you alright? Why? Because one of my ex-nemeses now lives in the same building? Do I not look okay? I'm thinking calming thoughts. You seem very relaxed. Okay, good. Which is surprising, because when you sleep tonight, all that separates you from one of your greatest nemeses is a 500-year-old wooden door. And now I'm anxious. <laughs> we can find him alternative lodging. Perhaps in limbo? No, no. I think this could be a good bonding experience for Eddie and me. Sure, I didn't exactly bond with the symbiote, but you know what I mean. I will take your word for it. Anyway, that's not the only reason I'm on edge. Back in the sewer, Mephisto called me by my name. Is that something I need to worry about? I'm pretty sure he knows who everyone is. Mephisto tries to get under everyone's skin. Just ignore him. Yeah, you're right. Maybe I'll tinker with my web shooters for a bit. Gotta take my mind off all this. Alright, anyone else from chat? 
No. Okay. Cool. I hope inviting Too bad. Into our home doesn't corrupt us. Actually, uh, oh no, you can't see it there. Let's take a walk down the hallway here. Uh, so that is he, he, he should. Oh, there he is. So this is his room here. <clears throat> can't see it yet. Uh, I don't know. Is your curtain open? Can I uh, peek through here and see what you're? So uh, it's actually got some iron uh, workout stuff. Got your TV or uh, I mean your uh, video camera, newspapers. Um, a lot of newspapers. I mean, there's some on the floor, a stack over there, or a stack there. Uh, are you doing like a newspaper route while you're here? This is like Club Med for superheroes. All right, let's go ahead and cycle to the next day. So the doctor should want to talk today because we boosted his friendship up to four. I'm kind of curious to see what his boost is. Um, and we may get something from Magic for new supplies for the next emo club meeting. Right, but before we go on, I'm gonna grab me a drink real quick, so I'll be back in just a few minutes.
All right, so let's go. Uh, let's go do our morning collections. And then uh, talk to the doctor. And then talk to the other folks. They want to talk. Yeah, you do those pull-ups, Peter. Much of a consolation prize, but knowing you're still on our side makes me feel a lot better. Well, that's good to hear. Uh, what do we got in here today? Need to pick me up. Crit chance for strength. Yeah. Uh, I'm just not sold on those yet. Let's see, no doggo in here. Doctor Strange is shaking us off. I'm sure he's seen worse. Damn it! We needed that sanctum. Well, it's gone, so get over it. Was he in the forge? I mean, he was she in the forge? Magic wants to talk. Lost headquarters support group. No, it must be outside then. You over there again? Yes, you are. Who is a good girl? It is my Charlie girl. Um, we're missing somebody. Oh no, never mind. She's at the bar. Or, okay, so let's go talk to uh, talk to him. And yeah, these are our next ingredients list. Uh, oh, that's why she wants to talk because I have all of that. Okay. I almost sent my astral form to cover more ground. That means you were trying to ghost me? I caution against speaking in modern vernacular as it rapidly evaporates from the pool of youthful lexicon. Then magic will say you are <coughs> unclear. Unfathomable. According to magic, we are besties now. Ah, yes. <clears throat> Our last conversation afforded me valuable insight into my current state of being. Your continued confidence and honesty with me have rekindled some of my own belief in myself. Um. I'm gonna go with this route. Sorcerer Supreme is a role only one mortal in a generation can hold. Fancy titles impress the illusion of rank upon the world, but that's all it is. A name for one who understands much, yeah. and yet so little at the same time. I am merely a man with a very useful set of skills who worked to fill a niche. I will light a beacon every step of the way. The doubt never crossed my mind. You have my gratitude, Hunter. Perhaps the Sorcerer Supreme could conjure me up an ice cream cone? Due to Stark's contractual obligations, I can only offer Avengers-themed flavors. <laughs> Nobody needs the caloric marvel that is Hulka Hulka burning love. A single scoop is a meal unto itself. Hulka Hulka burning no love. No matter what the outcome of our struggle <clears throat> is, you have not given up on me. That is a bond that carries beyond words and worlds. All right, so now 50% chance to generate two heroism. Good. All right. What you got to say, Dead? Or do you need help? No, you need help, huh? Help me. Perform a hero combo with Deadpool in combat. We can try. My charm won you over. All right. Let's go give Magic her um, gone. ingredients. I have something for you. Oh. Here you are. You are good at following direction. 
<laughs> no, we're in the, no, I'm not. Um. <clears throat> I'm ready when you are. I guess we could send a couple people on some missions. Just because. Want to read something that'll make you weep? Take a look at this. All right, make me weep. Um, a midnight and a defender. Um, all right, let me take a look here because I always forget who's who. Um, you're both thinking you and you. Yeah, we'll send Blade and him. Actually, hold on. No, because she's a mystic and a mutant. Wait, is she a mutant? Yeah. Storm's a mutant. Um, and he is a Avenger and a tactic, I believe, right? Yeah. So... I mean, there's no one that needs anything. I suppose we could send him as a defender. I don't know if I, I don't know if I've got all. I presume I. Well, no, we don't have all of his abilities. And there's probably a legendary that we get when we boost his friendship up. Um, <clears throat> actually, in looking at this, okay, other than me, because obviously we have a shit ton of skills. Um, I do like how it keeps stats on everything. Um, so let me just see here. One, okay, considering this guy has got his, uh, challenge done. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so based on this, um, once they've completed their friendship challenge, they'll be at 10. Okay, so, so he's at nine. So I've got all of his cards until he gets his friendship challenge. I uh, got all of hers, all of his, um, I've got all of hers until we hit her thing. Although she could probably do with another extra card here or there, uh, just so for uh, we can get some upgrades. Obviously, we need to build his up. Um, and I think we could build yours up as well. Problem is, neither one of you two um, are, uh, um, what should we call it? Got some match the bonuses on these and I like doing the bonus stuff so uh, Midnight Sun Blade and New York Defender Find Doctor take care of these myself all right I guess in the the sanctum has fallen yeah no shit all right Let's see what goodies we got here um so this is from venom and i fail pay intel to modify general missions okay <clears throat> right but anyhow we gotta take both of them on a uh missions for those welcome to tony scary demon cave on tony and how can i assist you today? well you can assist me by giving me some venom cards what can i say except you're welcome that's a good one. I'm pretty sure Charlie left the steaming coil in the hallway. Third um, You know, I think we'll go with these two. Let me just go ahead and re-roll. Let me re-roll this one just to see. Okay, we'll go with these two. I don't remember what mods he has on his opportunists. Draw a card on redraw, gain block. You know what? I'd rather get a card. 
All right, so we'll go upgrade that one. We can go ahead and get rid of this one. All right, and then for Venom, we picked up this. All right, so do we? Okay, so what is? I forget what is the upgrade on this two? On a KO, next attack doesn't cost ravenous. So do we upgrade anything here? Chain two, chain two, that chains four. What's the upgrade on this? On KO does not consume a ravenous. That's actually good. Because these chains can be chained to one target. <clears throat> uh, these are knockbacks, but when they're upgraded, they become forceful. Um, Mm. There's 444. Okay, let me do some math here. 44 times 4 is 176. So technically, you will do less than this, flat damage wise. But this guy here can be spread around. Uh, And I'm, I don't know if the damage we're seeing here is, yeah, let me, let me reread the tutorial on him. Uh, Venom Ravenous. Uh, his offense increases for each point of Ravenous. Starts every encounter with the max amount and then you consume one, which means his damage will go down. So, the question is, and I guess we'll find out when we take him on a mission, is, are these damage numbers here based on three ravenous or zero ravenous? We're gonna find out. Uh, I'll leave his cards as is for now. <clears throat> but I will go ahead and upgrade Spidey's opportunist. Time to take it to the next level. Um, and then, old dogs. no excuses here. Okay, so what I want to find is a mission. I want to find the mission later with Deadpool and Spidey. They're not Deadpool. Excuse me, Deadpool. Um. America and Symbiote, or uh, Venom. Um, could do that. Um, actually, that's all we can do right now. Okay. So I guess we're going over here to do some shit. Um, well, it's going to take him. Knock back three enemies. Yeah, I'm sure we could do that. And then uh, we'll take you, and we'll take you. Hold on a second. I just before before we do this, let me look at something for Deadpool. I thought I, I knew there was something missing. Like you, you're never changing your outfit. And I was wondering why. It's because I forgot to tell you to change your outfit. All right. Yeah. So we already bought that. All right. So you and you. This should be an interesting combination. Thinking. 
Although I like how <laughs> right now he's walking in his non superhero outfit. That happened once before. I don't remember who it was with. Um. Well, I totally forgot what we're doing here. Oh, okay. Well, uh, mystics. Okay. If Hydra's mystics succeed in opening that rift, they'll call even more of Lilith's children to their side. Well. Yeah, we got Hellhounds going after Deadpool. Yeah, they are all are. Um, that's a pretty big propane tank. I mean, I gotta say, that's like a super-sized propane tank. All right, um, two of them are uh, targetable. Let's uh, okay. Let's see who's going after who here. Um. We got one, two, three going after dead. Two going after the captain. And then one unknown here. Um, do I have... I don't have his card yet. Um, kind of sucks. Um, which means... But we do have... No, we don't. Um... Alright, so we can go ahead and... Oh, wow. You're not a baby. Huh. I thought the dogs were always babies. That dog's a baby. All right, we can chain those two. All right. That's a quick. So go ahead and kill those two babies there. Technically, you know, so Pain and Pinata won't work on you, uh, even though it's a, an AoE attack. But I could do that to have them stop, but after what we learned last time uh, with those guys, I think we're going to hold off on, you know, unless I can get a, a full kill on you. Uh, he looks, I'm guessing he took his health to make the shield. Um, we could do that, give everyone some block, because that will help. Um, these two here, 190 and one, uh, 200. Um, he's going to lose his, whatchamacallit. Um, go ahead and do this because he might get the one special card that I want for him. So go ahead and do that right now. <clears throat> and did I? No, but we got that. Damage and taunts each enemy in an area. I could do that. How big of an area is it? Uh, I could do that. That's one option. Um, we could do this to break his shield. Um, and then technically, and this may get us killed. If I did this, oh, no, we don't have nothing. Because I was gonna say I could then 
theoretically do the shield balance over here. Uh, I don't have any other quicks, do I? All right, we're gonna take a chance. We're gonna do this, then have him do the tactician, I think. Oh, didn't realize that applied weak. Maybe I should pay attention to re and read the cards a little closer. All right, go ahead and do this. <clears throat> Roger that. Yes, he's gonna need some. Uh... Gonna like this. <laughs> okay, you got blocked too. <clears throat> All right, um, well, it's a hero combo, but it's not the hero combo with dead. Uh, let's see. Let's see, dead. Uh, 92, 80, um... Let's go ahead, because there's no one else over here, right? Because that people are dead. Right, dead. Uh, I could do that, but we'll wait, because if we break his shield, we'll see if we can get him over here. I'm going to come over here. I could vault. But I'm going to save my hero points. They're going to knock you into him. Wait. Oh, that's a, oh, that's a fissure. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got about that fissure. Uh, apply one week to any unit knocked into this ley line, and it detonates. So that would actually apply uh, another week to well, uh, it'll kill him. That's gonna kill you for a long. Uh, it does at least 80 some points of damage. Now it makes me wonder, I, I don't wanna, I don't wanna blow that up. So I'm gonna not hit that intentionally. Okay. Cause that's an explosive ley line. This here's a stun ley line. Uh, is there any other ley lines? I, I mean, I saw the red one. I just I missed the blue one. All right. Yeah, let's see what happens here. Mystics are digging deeper, reaching for something to call for. Well, it didn't daze them, so that's good. Some time here. Uh, I retract my previous statement. <clears throat> no protection? Or is that guy, is that guy gonna go back and protect? He's gonna protect a different one this time. But every time he protects someone... Oh, did he regain his health when he dropped his shield? Alright, um... So, Dead's down for the count for the moment, because... No, I'm sorry. America's down for the count for the moment. Um... You know what? Screw it. Do this on him. Extra 
Um, well, we gotta re-roll because we have... We're gonna re-roll this guy. Uh, I actually want to use that. Um, how long is he dazed for? One more, two more hands. One more card play. Um, screw it, go ahead and re-roll this. I don't see... I don't see us building up that high. I actually want to use this. Um, <clears throat> well, technically I'd want to use this at the beginning of the attack phase. Um, go ahead and do this one. Come on, give me a... Now... Yeah, so... Okay, so 59, so... The, the what we saw with the card was the base damage. Um, you're taunted. Um, this will go two. So we can kill these two. And then, depending on where we land, we can do a knockback on somebody. A quick okay, so that should wake him up. Okay. We could do that. I don't plan on doing that. Um, I plan on taking Venom here. And doing a move knock. And you're dead either way you look at it. Okay. <clears throat> Um, he's going after Venom. Uh, if target was damaged, turn that into forceful and KO. Draw two cards, apply one weak. I'm thinking about doing this on him. Cause he he was damaged this round. Venom damaged him. If I can get this thing turned. Um. This will be forceful. Uh, it's not gonna do that much damage on you, unfortunately. But you know what? It'll put a, put a weakness on you. It's nice of Lilith to keep restocking the practice dummies for us. All right. Oh, that's free. Oh, well, if that's free, go ahead and do that. I didn't realize that was free. Okay. Uh, we've already done our move. All right. I plan on doing this next round on those first and foremost. <clears throat> Wounded, that's not good per se. Taking out more doggos. Okay, that's that's fine. You're gonna self destruct. Oh no, you're protect going in protection mode. The problem is I the damn protection mode. Um, that could work. Um, on something. Um, all right, we're gonna do this. Screw it. Are we excited? <laughs> okay, so now those are gonna become active in attack. 
one mystic out. All right. Um. Chain two. Well, uh, you two are babies. I can ram you guys. Um, knock back any direction. I can knock you into that. Actually, let's see. Just out of curiosity. Uh, come on. Come on, camera. That'll do 215. 31% chance of that. Um, we also got that we can blow up. Because you're vulnerable. So is that, actually. So... 31% chance there. Can't get an angle on that. 156 damage there. Although, it'd be better, almost, if I were to fling something like that doggo. Oh, that doggo won't go that far. Okay. Uh, or I could put you into a stun. <clears throat> the double chain. And we got a whole bunch of people coming after America. I'm not sure what they're going to do this time around. Um, that costs one. That's a vault. That's a slide. That's a throw. That was blessed. I'm not familiar with blessed. All right, I'm going to... I really wish it would stop changing the camera angles every time I select someone. Um, actually, if I hit that, problem is with us being in that radius. Uh, so Venom and... Uh, he needs a move. Otherwise, he's going to get hit with the uh, fallout of that. And he will also. Um... Uh, okay. Yeah, I, I don't remember seeing that card before, so was, or that uh, mission thing before. Oh, that reminds me. That's why that one was free. Because we upgraded that one thing, and the first mission card that we collect is free. Let's see. He's wounded. He's coming after us. We actually want to do this. So we get the resists. Um, I think we're going to taunt you. Yeah, we're going to taunt you. So that'll give me <clears throat> that gives me three resists so resist him and we'll resist him plus I can move I can move him over here just to get him out of the way of this explosion that we're going to do with venom we won't be able to do uh the one thing I want to do not this round but go ahead and do this all right then with venom we need to move him outside of this ring here um things I don't know so if I do this he's gonna move right there anyhow so he's gonna take damage um Uh, 
it'll take a little bit of damage but no one else is attacking you as of right now so maybe you'll get your life steal back go ahead and do this that is that helps clear a whole bunch of them off of the screen of uh, the field all right so that one there we can apply what and that would only apply to him. I think he's considered a little one. Um, and him and the dogs. Because these are humanish. If that's the word I'm looking for. We do have a hero combo. Kind of wish it was Deadpools um, that we can use. We do have this available as well. Actually, these guys here have a crap ton of health. So, probably be better to use this on one of them. Um, all right, let's see what happens here. Well, actually, I have another move available. Now, I haven't done the, the, the shove attack. <clears throat> so we could do, um, I, I suppose we could put you into that, although that would... I don't know how. Oh, because he's got resist. Um, that'll take you down to 222. That would take you down to 295. But you know what? I want you to damage this person over here. Alright, now let's see what happens here. Let's. I'm working on it. Something's not right. More not right than usual, even. He shouldn't be dazed. Well, you can still be dazed and uh, resist an attack. Okay, we need to stop this lady this turn. Um, I think. Uh, we got two turns. <clears throat> His shield isn't that high. Um, this here. Uh, your shield is at 35, so I, I, I can actually chain you and chain you. Then your health is so low, I'm not going to even worry about using that as a card. <clears throat> uh, he's dazed for two card plays. Alright, so one, two, and then he can kill... He can kill one of these uh, mystics completely. Um, or, let's see. Uh, no, well, I mean, we do need to do a knockback, but uh, I'll do a, a manual knockback. Uh, we'll do this on, said, we'll hit you. But technically, I can't hit you. Um, we could, you know what, screw it, double chain him. Yeah, double chain his ass. Get, get him out of the equation. Damn, turn him to... Turn him to damn broken stones. Alright. So now he will go ahead and kill the two doggos. Um, because that's... We go ahead and use this combo because it's cheaper. Uh, and actually... Well, it doesn't matter. Uh, he's going to overkill either one of these two. Um... This target is at full health, so he won't get the bonus damage on it. So let's go ahead and kill. Um, where's Captain America? Captain America. Uh, let's go ahead and kill the one that has higher health. Allow me. <laughs> Why is that 
Well, this is a record for me. I've never had it in the three before. <clears throat> All right, so uh, Venom is going to... Oh, we still need to hit her. Uh, actually, yeah, you may actually, you may have the angle. Let's find out. Yep, do that. Okay, that'll prevent any new dogs from coming up. So now we just have to deal with the witches. Um, and these are baby dogs, so I don't need this anymore. Um, so go ahead and re-roll that. See if I get anything good. Uh, that's good. That's quick. So that's a free play on one of the doggos. Um, he's got. Uh, he's gonna lose his shit. Unfortunately, because he only has one resist, and both these dogs are coming after him. But he'll he'll go back down to two. He won't lose at all, unless someone else hits him. Let's see what happens. Hail Hydra. Oh, you know what? Oh, it just dawned on me. I could have shot that damn uh, propane tank and killed them both. Maybe. Oh well. Didn't even didn't even think about it. Yeah, I could have done that. Ain't that? I I had I had the damn shit to do it too. That's my bad. Uh, oh, but hey, we got a Deadpool combo, and uh. He wants us to play Deadpool combo for uh, hero help. Um, make a ram attack in hand critical after, uh, in addition to this. All right. Um, let me think here. Who's going after who here? Okay, you got three going after uh, this dude here. Don't know about her exactly. She may roll out another grenade or some shit like that. <clears throat> Actually, we can do a web toss you into that. I think that's what we're gonna do with you. We're gonna kill, because we can't kill you flat out with this. Although we get to, we'll get you close enough where we could quick kill you. All right, go ahead and do this hero combo on her. We're going. All right. All right, so now I'm gonna do, uh, let's go ahead and do this quick. Well, it's either we do the quick on her. Yeah, let's do the quick on her. Uh, I'm not really worried about these little babies here. So quick her. Or, hold on, hold that thought. Because Venom can just knock her into that. Uh, that would be a kill. Or better yet, Venom could knock him into that. Actually, I think that's what we'll probably do. So quick kill this one. So do that. Um, yeah, go ahead and do that. You wouldn't have lasted five minutes back at Camp Lehigh. All right, then. Um, oh, wow. So if he's at zero, sim uh, zero symbionts, which she's at now, or is he a ravenous? No, he's at ravenous too. <laughs> um, com confused. I don't remember. I don't. Maybe I never had a damage before. Um, but he clearly got ravenous. So I just that that value there just seems weird. 
All right, anyhow, um, we're gonna fling you. Ah, uh, I won't fling you far enough. Well, you know what? <clears throat> we could do that, or we could do that, or we can just fling you over here and we'll spend a point to blow up that thing. So, you know, what? that's what we're gonna do. That's right, that, that crit thing that, yeah, that's right. Uh, from that, uh, makes sense. I mean, all right, so, go ahead, no, not, uh, game block, oh, a little late to do that now. Um, yeah, let's do this. You. Ah, if I can. Get... I'm gonna knock you into that. Which will stun him. I think, yep. He's stunned. Alright, now. And actually, we could do this. For a couple things. All right, so Deadpool, go ahead and shoot this. Actually, hold that thought, Deadpool. We're out of moves. I'm just looking here to see. Venom? Okay. I know how she's dying. All right, so Deadpool. No, Deadpool. Yeah, you shoot this. I'm gonna get you. Okay. <clears throat> we'll go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pop this one here. Uh, either one, it doesn't matter. Um, we'll go ahead and pop this one here. All right, that gives us extra heroism. So now, smash that bitch. Still not quite enough to kill her, but she'll be dead next round. I like how, <laughs> you gonna, are you gonna run back over to where you were? That's, that's kind of actually amusing. Uh, I like how she ran out of the way. Um, uh, no range on that. Um, all right. I might have moves. All right, let's see what happens here. Her children will join us soon. All right. <sighs> So, you're a baby, all I gotta do is a move hit into that, and you're dead. Um, and you're a baby for all intents and purposes. Um, knock back, but there's nothing to knock you back into. Um, that would do it. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Uh, Let's see. Here, let's put her in her hole. Bye bye, bitch. <laughs> All right, you go ahead and enjoy this. And this guy's interrogatable, which is kind of funny. Well, we're gonna, uh, we can knock him into that, so might as well go ahead and interrogate him. <sighs> we can make you talk. Yeah, 
Yeah, some money. All right, go ahead and knock that hellhound dog into that. Stacking them deep today. We well, we'll be lucky if we get two stars on this one. Yeah, I wasn't expecting it. A lot of turns on that one. Well, relatively speaking. And I, okay, I don't know why they want to do this. No pixelizations. You know, turn that shit off. You know. All right. Yeah, it's better. All right, so now, um, I don't know if we got to uh, hang out tonight or not. Tonight could be a book club. Or hell, tonight could be a shop club thing. We haven't had a shop meeting lately. Uh, shop class, okay. Off to shop class. How's my thing? Uh, we're supposed to have shop class tonight, but Robbie... Tony really got under his skin. I've never seen him this mad. Can you help me talk him down? Sure. Lead the way. Thanks, Hunter. I see Tony's been working. What the hell have you done, Tony? Far, Tony. Explain how replacing outdated equipment is a problem. You moved my car. It was in the way, and I moved it back. Ah, uh, crap. All this flashy junk isn't why I'm here. Why any of the rest of us are here. Well, I'm here to make progress. If you aren't, then get out of the way. Never meet your heroes. I get it now. I don't know why I thought you could change. Yeah, Tony, I think you may have, I mean, granted, it looks better. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, 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 game. Granted, it looks more organized and cleaner, you know, but, uh, still. Robbie just needs a little space. Let's get started. Now that we know Wanda's a threat, you'll need an edge if you face her again. What kind of edge? Nothing that involves her coming to harm. We're looking at ways to protect you from her abilities. How is that possible? Our first prototype keeps you connected to the real world in case Wanda alters it around you. Like an anchor, tethering me to reality? Exactly. If Wanda alters your reality, our second prototype alters it back. Robbie got the idea from his spirit of vengeance. I think the prototype is powered by Hellfire, so best not to jostle it. Like a button I press to reset her alterations, or a broadcast interfering with her own transmission? Perfect, you got it. Thanks for getting me those components, we're good to go. Time to, uh, Tony, what's up? I think your gearhead pal is still wound up. Uh, okay. Hunter, give me a minute. I wanna make sure Robbie's okay. Take your time. I'll assemble the prototype for the hunter. Oh, I'd prefer to hold off. There are some details I want to go over before we begin. Oh, come on. You've managed so far. How hard can it be for me? Uh, sure. Fine. <laughs> All right, Tony, you need to I've noticed the step back a little bit. Longer to finish these prototypes than he should. I have some ideas. Just a moment. Give me a minute. You know what? Don't worry about it. I can handle this myself. Okay. Sit back and watch the master at work. Did I just say, wait a minute? I'm pretty sure I said, wait a minute. Yeah, what would you give me? <clears throat> Reality anchor. It's like the hero, they gain immunity to knockback for the rest of the encounter. And revitalizing swarm, cure all heroes. For free. Hmm. Well, there's only one enemy that 
I've seen not do a knockback on me. Well, no. Let me take that back. You got the shield dude who'll do a knockback. I guess the the mystic folks, those people that we have to interrupt their whatever the hell it is they're doing, they technically do a knockback as well. We cure all heroes. Uh, I don't think I've ever had multiple heroes be impacted by something. So, you know what? I'm going to go with this. I'll probably never use it. For a round two? I don't want to butt heads, but to quote a frenemy, I can do this all day. Tony, I, I don't want to fight you. You were my hero growing up. Kids do love Iron Man. Not Iron Man. You, Tony. The man who could fix any problem with technology. What do you want, Robbie? Ten years ago, you bought the Salazar steel plant, then shut it down. Do you remember what you said at the press conference? When you announced the Stark Technology Center? Uh, something witty? You said, I'm here to make progress. If you aren't, you should get out of my way. Tony, you put half the families in my neighborhood out of work. And for what? You never even broke ground on that technology center. I don't even remember this. Three years later, most of the families who you put out of work had moved away. Follow the jobs, you know? The rest of us weren't so lucky. That's when things got real bad. But those families had it right. You need to know when it's time to move on. So good luck with shop class. I hope it's all the progress you want it to be. You too, Parker? Yeah, Tony. If I could manage it, how hard can it be for you? Well, I didn't think that was a wake-up call for Tony. What just happened? Um... I know what happened, but I'm gonna go this route. Bobby never mentioned anything about a steel plant. He said 10 years ago? I don't remember buying a steel plant in LA. Was he wrong? Probably not. Salazar Steel. That name is familiar. I can fix this. Maybe, but not tonight. Not much to say, for once. No, oh, is that it? Okay, I guess that's it. Um, where's Robbie at? Iron Man and go boo. Would he piss himself? I gotta know. Man, I just wish I could have brought my brother Gabe along. All right. Well, I guess. Uh, yeah, that's not how I expected shop class to go. Quite honestly, guys. Um, but on the flip side, it's a. Uh, Tony getting mixed into it. Evil doers beware. Yeah, you kind of expect him to do something like that. I mean, I don't think it's an you know, it's uh, I mean, that's what I'm looking for. It's not malicious. It's just Tony being Tony. Um I will see if I can find you a treat later. But maybe after uh, after that conversation with Robbie, maybe uh, Tony's gonna have a a change of heart. Who's to say? Next time we see Shop Class, it's who knows? Maybe it'll be reverted back to what it was. If there's a next time, I mean, we're not really getting anything out of Shop Class, quite honestly. Um, Stuff that we'll never use. You know, I think what we're actually gonna do. I think we'll go ahead and actually build that one thing that we haven't built yet. Just because, well. Uh, okay, what do you need? Uh, oh yeah, I completed your quest. Your your request. Thanks, uh, you're welcome. And uh. I never ran into a steak too chewy for my choppers. Uh, Before you say anything, just let me get this out there. Okay. I'm sorry. 
For what? Lilith hijacked my brain and made me do some terrible things. Oh, for things that. that. Hurt innocent people. Now Doctor Strange's church is a parking lot. I'm gonna say he's gonna have to earn my trust. Nah, I'll go this route. Good. Mother manipulates people against their will. We all know this. Well, that's good to hear. So I take it you've experienced that manipulation firsthand. She is my mother. Oh, right. I just hope Doctor Strange doesn't hold it against me. I know the Sanctum is where he liked to do his rituals or prayers or whatever. He just needs time. With our help, Strange will recover. I doubt he blames you, Eddie. He doesn't have to. I blame myself. Look, I get what he's feeling right now. I've spent more than a few nights crashing in bus stations or sleeping on the beach. I go this route. Last, today, you have a place at the Abbey. Yeah. Thanks for that. I'll do my best not to let Lilith burn this one down. You sound conflicted about your past. Well, we all have things we wish we could forget. Everyone? Even Captain America? Are you kidding? I hear he used to wear leather pants. <laughs> oh, you obviously haven't seen some of the pants that Hunter here wears. <clears throat> Let's see, uh, you're 2 of 15, okay, uh, let's see here, he's pending a friendship level, oh, that's actually, I didn't realize he even hit a friendship level, um, he's in prestige mode, we might be able to boost him up, about to make a protein shake if anybody wants one, well, that's kind of him, uh, can we count on that? Take a look at this mole on my... Never mind. Actually, uh, how many compliments do we have available? Um, six. Yeah, we can wait until we take him on a mission or so. All right, so... Whoops. Uh, let's hit the sack. And uh, head on to the next day. All right, so tonight should be book club night. All right, so before we do this, I'm going to grab me a drink real quick. I'll be back in just a few minutes.
Alrighty, so let's go ahead and uh, oh, this is the next morning. All right, uh, let's go talk to Deadpool. Oh, shop clothes. Okay, uh, we're gonna do that. <clears throat> so we'll go get Peter his stuff. I did not expect to meet you here. For real, having confessional in a church? It's like somebody couldn't think of anywhere better. You wish to confess something? You may have noticed that I mess around a lot. I'm the handsome, super buff comedic relief of the Abbey. Get this, it's all an act. I'm actually a magician. Um. No, really? You had me fooled. I'm a master baiter hunter. <laughs> you just couldn't see it until now. And now that I have, I am scarred for life like you. Touche, hunter. Touche yourself, Deadpool. Oh, I need no encouragement. So why do you turn everything into jokes? It's a hell of a lot easier than being vulnerable and showing my entire ass. No one gets to see that for free. Do you ever get tired of keeping up this charade? Oh, you want to play charades? Here I thought we were having a serious conversation about how I'm completely faking it. So why put on this act if it is all fake? It protects me, and it pushes the people I care about far away. We all know there's never a happy ending when I'm involved. Well, that does not sound like a way to live. What would you do in my position then, huh? Um, hard to say. I do not know, but pushing your loved ones away is not good. Uh, it is if it keeps them above the ground. They deserve to know you are worried. Whoa, did you see that? You gave me chills just now. Ugh, I hate it when you're right. You should know by now that I usually am. But there is something else you should know. None of us truly know what we are doing. <laughs> Coming from you, that's rich. I do not always have it all figured out. You sure put on a good show. You ever worried about breaking down? Um. All the time. I try not to let it consume me. The cool as a cucumber approach. A classic strat. Not sustainable, though. We all just need to hold it together until the end. Then, we can take a minute to ourselves. I'm clenched up all the time, Hunter. It makes my muscles look bigger. Look, I'm glad we cleared the air, but don't go telling people I'm actually a giant softy. I'd still like to keep my badass card. I think our colleagues would enjoy seeing this side of you. Not as much as I enjoy being a menace. Sorry, Hunter. I'm going to keep it on the DL for now. Is that the Deadpool lockdown? See? You get me! When you don't want to talk about something, you stick it in the hole. <laughs> All right, so now uh, you recover 65 health each turn, plus an additional 21 health for each turn. Okay. All right, let's go do our morning uh, collections. Stop by uh, Peter to give him the next shop class stuff. Pet puppy here. Who is a good girl? It is my Charlie girl. Lilith seeks to wipe all our havens from the earth. Nothing new to read. The same. Lilith's not stopping, and neither are we. All right, which, what, how can I help you today? Can I ask a favor? Pick up all collected. Well, I've already done that. Quarter support group. See, that was an easy one. Thanks, Hunter. Oh, my pleasure. Damn it. We needed that sanctum. Man. Hello, movie nerd nar narration guy. As a fellow time displaced person, perhaps there are some gaps we can help <clears throat> each other with. 
Yes, I have a lot of cultural catching up to do. I have time to field a question, and I'd like to hear about America before it was a country. Okay. Are tavern songs and operas still the toast of the town? I hate to break it to you, but opera wasn't too popular even in my day. A lot of music from your time became other things. Tavern songs went away with the invention of the jukebox, but parents sing three blind mice to their children to get them to sleep. They sing what? Three blind mice is not suitable for children. <laughs> it is a grim song about the queen executing Protestants. I don't even think I knew that bit of trivia. Neither did I. Like the melody is easy to sing and is very catchy. It is an earworm about wanton capital punishment. Well, thankfully, kids don't really grasp that context. <laughs> Adjusting to a new time is tricky. We need a support group for people displaced in time. We used to run one at Avengers Tower on the new moon of every month. I'm sure we'll get one set up again once we stop the prophecy. I'll save you a seat next to Miguel. He drops by from time to time. He's from the year 2099. Nice guy. All right, that's actually I'm okay. Is any of what th he just said true? Um, in terms of the rhymes history, the first version was published to the Queen of Lord, the editor. Um, Actually, it kind of is. Huh. Wow. I honestly, uh, I didn't know that. I mean, I, I've, I've heard the rhyme, sort of. Um, but <laughs> didn't really understand its dark history. Wow. The things you learn playing a game. Uh, where's the spot? There's Spidey. Hey, you got your, uh... Ever get the feeling like there's more going on that no one's telling you? I have something for you. Tickets to next year's Stark Expo? Components for shop class. Be honest. Have I traveled back in time? No. You sent me a message. Right. I set those up before the last meeting. And you got one. So... What should I do with these components? Mm, I can take them. Are you sure? Yeah. If you hand them over, I can get Tony and Robbie talking again. And if not? I'll give them all back. Deal? Okay. Agreed. On the bright side, Hunter, you didn't turn into a... So, how's it going, ladies? The sanctum's gone. It's unbelievable. Yeah, it's unbelievable. Alright, really um... <clears throat> go ahead and... I mean, I... Is there even any points in doing the intel missions? I mean, other than the... Open them up for intel themselves. Um... What have you got for me, boss? All right, give me something good here. Uh, that's a new one. Damage, damage each enemy in an area. 10% to apply bind. I like that. Uh, another one of those things. Pain pinata. Punch. Um, we are using punch. And it's already upgraded. <clears throat> Definitely taking that one. Uh, we have a modded version of that already. 
Um, and we have a modern version of that that does vulnerable. Um, this guy here. So, let's see, knock back with taunt, or knock back and yeah, I think I'd actually do this one here. Until next time. All right, so I'm thinking about replacing. Well, so the normal version of punch is 40 some damage but then when you upgrade it, it becomes 86 damage but um yeah i think i'd rather just go with the because we got two taunts there um think about changing that one out for this Because having a, the ability of uh, using forceful, um, I, I like. Um, I suppose. Well, here's the deal. Well, mm, take that one out, put that one in. Go ahead and redraw this, or not redraw, salvage that one. And then salvage this one. Um, that's an ally taunt. That could be beneficial. <clears throat> uh, that's a tough one. I kind of like that. Well, I think so. What's the uh, upgrade on this? And gain in one counter. Um, we'll keep that as is. Okay, so upgrade his uh, other one. And for you, Spike Burst. What's the upgrade for this? Uh, Cost one less. Okay. And what's the upgrade for this one again? Um, if you get a KO, the next card doesn't use Ravenous, okay. And what's this one again? KO doesn't consume Ravenous. You know what I'm thinking here? I think we're going to do this. Take you out, take you out, put you in, put you in. Upgrade, no, sorry, uh, Spike. The strike. Uh, we'll upgrade Tasty Brain. Uh, what's the upgrade of Symbian do? Next two cards. All right, and yeah, we we'll go ahead and upgrade those two. Oh, he's a Bombinal Snowman. Uh, today. Uh, any research? No. I'm happy to help, Hunter. Wait. So you don't know we haven't yet. Uh, nothing new there. Alright, so... Upgrade your handshake. And then... Upgrade that. <clears throat> and upgrade that. See you around. It looks like Storm's out there training now. And uh, we have uh, Snake Eyes Deadpool. To say something corny yet uplifting before battle. I hear someone else. No. I'm just hearing things. Doctor Strange is showing me pointers on the staff of one. Alright, we'll go ahead and get their rewards even though they're damn yeah. although let me go back and take a look at something here um 
Actually, that one there. Hold well, on, now I actually got to take a look at his stuff. Tony and Doctor Strange may think they're. Um, are we using the conceal one here? Yeah. Um, but that's unmodded. What's the modded one we just picked up for you? Um, give us an extra one. All right, go ahead and take that out. Put. We'll go ahead and get that upgraded. So one for him. And then Blade. The Daywalker. Okay, so the Daywalker is the same. Uh, the Reaper, though. We're going to go ahead and swap Reaper out for that one. Okay, so go. Uh, let's go upgrade the Doctor and Blade real quick. Nice again. Back again. So, yeah, this one here. We need any so if he's if he's at if blades at full health, he does extra damage. I like that one. Um, which I think that's the. I have to look here. Uh, see what <clears throat> Daywalker we're using. Uh, I'll put that one there. Yeah. An enhanced spell. Most welcome. Uh, let me take a look at Blades thing again. All right then. You're using the one that applies weak. We have a Daywalker that applies weak, and then. Let me. I must, have, I must have been misreading something. All right. So actually, uh, make sure here it's the new Reaper. Okay, cool. All right. Let's see what missions are available. We'll do one more mission tonight. Um, I don't want to push the story missions, not those. All right, so I don't want to do his yet. Defeat enemies, defeat heavy enemies, stop helicopter, destroy device. Um, okay, so we'll take Carol uh, and then the other two. Because I still need to do, what, two more? Oops, uh, I need to do one more for Venom, two more for him, so... We'll have all three of them go together. So let's see. <clears throat> Blueprint. Uh, really? <clears throat> okay, well, I guess we'll. I don't didn't realize I trained with you two missions ago. All right, let's go ahead and train with him. All right. Thing. Okay, so do hers. Actually, let me save. I haven't saved for a while. I'm still saving and waiting. All right. Uh, have her play five abilities, get some extra gloss. Sure, why not? And uh, taking you and taking you. So is he gonna be in? No. So, what do you change like on the way when we're in the portal or uh, in limbo? Okay. Oh. Well. <clears throat> 
I'm on my way. You know, I think we may well. Uh, Carol, you got a whole bunch of people coming after you. <clears throat> Supernova could come in handy here. Um. That guy there is going to be a nice one to tangle with. All right, so we got a quick uh, knockback in any direction. You're not grounded. Um, we could bring you into that. That one there, or we could knock you back into that one, actually. <clears throat> so that actually would work. Is that technically, oh, well, that's not uh, a knockback. Um, well, I mean, we can do that to knock you into that. Um, all right, so let's do that. Okay, so get that off of <coughs> Captain America. Um, baby, there's two babies here. So we can do a quick on, do a quick on this guy here. I'm going in. That was something. Okay, she could go supernova. Uh, let's see, Captain America, let's see, if you do Supernova, although that would be better if you were binary. Um, um, we could take you and throw you into that. How much damage would that do to you? Problem is where we're standing. Um, the punch you. Uh, I don't know. Can't can't target ourselves on that. All right, so I don't necessarily want to do that. Um, right, how about this? How about you grab this one here? Wait, are you in uh, are you in that ring? Yeah, Captain America is in that ring, unfortunately. All right, so how about this, Captain? No, not you, Captain. This other Captain. Captain, Captain, who's got the Captain? Um, you hit this one into that one. So now we've retaunted him, or well, off of him, just fine. Now, we can go ahead and take one of these guys here. You oh. come on, to him a turn. Um, that, unfortunately, he's he's going to stand right in the spot, and he's going to take damage. So it doesn't matter if I go after that one. Or if I go after this one here, he's going to stand in the spot and take damage. For whatever reason, and other than I could do this one here, but it kind of defeats the purpose of hitting one of the heavier ones. Screw it. Do this. Okay, 
I'm gonna have her do a regroup. All right. See what happens. Holy crap. Didn't realize those guys packed that much of a punch. Oh, look who's here. Yeah, that is an unwelcome surprise. Um, uh, the reality anchor. Oh, yeah. Although I don't remember Wanda doing knockbacks. I know her thing is a hex. Um, let's see here. Thinking about doing that. Or. Let me see here. That'll kill you. That will kill you. Well, actually, they're all going after Captain America this time. Um, Fists of Radiance will kill them all. I don't want to technically hit her just yet. Um... But, well, I think so. Well, he draws two of his cards. Um, hmm, damn it. Because on one hand, I need her to get the binary. Uh, that's a quick. Okay, here, do this. Because that'll kill this guy here. And it's a card replay. All right. After 80 years of failure, um, that's not quick though. I need him to do this because these guys pack a punch, and uh, we'll go ahead and do this. Watch my back. And hopefully we get a good card or two good cards. That's the stuff. That could be good. I'll give him a 342 block. Um, now, screw it. Let's do it. I don't know how this is gonna, how she's gonna deal with this. <clears throat> you know. If she does hex one, it's going to be one of either of theirs. We make a huh. great team. Okay, so she hexed him. Stop me. Uh, when a hero damages, there's a chance a random card is discarded from the hand. Okay, so his... Hey, okay, so discarded from the hand. But now is it like out of the mix completely? Um, okay, so she's going binary now. So now, um, knockback. Fortunately, her positioning on a knockback on him is not good. Um. I could do a supernova. Well, uh, supernova thankfully won't affect them. Let's see what happens with this. Well, we do a supernova and hit the dude on the uh, the one that's going after Venom. He's going to be taunted to go after us. <clears throat> we'll see how much 
I don't know if he's gonna punch us for 252. Let's see what happens here. Alright, well on the bright side, uh, she didn't get hexed. She does have a counter against him. So, it's not a resist, but still. Um, not gonna waste the slide on that dog. But I think what we'll do is we'll see if we can do the old one two combo. That won't make this easier for you. Text her. I won't forget this. That's okay. <clears throat> Let's see what happens here now. You don't understand her purpose. Nice counter. Good counter. Babies or not babies? I'm a glutton Inf for punishment. Fused? That's new. I almost felt that one. Okay, uh, Confused Hero will act unpredictably every time the other heroes take action. Uh, so you're telling me basically I can't use her. Okay. Um, yeah, we got three, uh, basically three babies. Um... Technically, she was damaged this round. This would kill her. All right, let's do this. Sorry, Wanda, nothing personal. Okay, what is she going to do? Now, did that take one of my moves? No, that just made her move over there. Um, I don't know if Captain America has got the angle on that. Um, I don't think you were damaged this round, were you? No. But and I can't get an, uh, can I get an angle for knockback? No, not on that. All right, um, chain four. That'll do it. <clears throat> so one, two, three, four. Works perfectly, just like I planned it. I doubt they'll take that beating to heart, but we can always hope. Although I don't know if we did what we needed for Carol. Because she got confused. Um, uh, yeah, I don't... Uh, well, no, actually, no, we did. It says right there, challenge reward. All right, good job, team. All right, good deal. That wasn't that bad. All right, and I think what we're gonna do is we will go ahead and call it here for now. And uh, we'll pick this up on our next session. All right then, so until next time.